gold, uh, your platinum, your silver, your copper, your sort of aged gold, and then you're getting another three meters over here. All of that for 37.48, you're saving 12 pounds and 15 pence, uh, 50 pence. You can't go wrong, that is such a good bundle, it really is. Uh, and also on top of that, if this is your only purchase today, you're gonna get the bracelet kit uh, to celebrate the fact that Aldrich Craft uh, have got their eighth birthday coming up. Okay, now we have got our steampunk kit. Take a look at this. So uh, it is a, another mammoth bundle, loads of goodies in the mix. You've got your cord. Whoo, <laughs> nearly 60% of the stock has gone very busy for this option. I think I t we always find because we've used something, it gets popular. So uh, nearly 60% of the stock. But let's again break it down for $24.99 what you are getting. So we've got our statement pieces in the mix. You're getting multiples of those. Uh, when I say multiples, you're getting one of each, but you're getting a lot of uh, designs. So I've just picked up four that you can see there. So those are large pieces. Then we've got our cogs, our clocks. You're also getting in the mix little uh, sort of glass cavachons. Look at all those beautiful cogs. That you can, and let me just, you can hear the quality of the cogs. And then you've got, I think it was my mic, I'm gonna to need to be closer. And then you've got here as well, look, at, let me just show you. If I just pour those in and you see all of the elements that you're getting in there. So uh, it's popular, over 60% of the stock has gone there. Actually, I apologize, nearly 60% of the stock. I was getting ahead of myself, but I think we are venturing into that territory. 24.99 your price, 028-875 your item number. Dependents. You can see the Jane's so passionate about what she brings you, and she puts so much of her time in sourcing the right bundles for you, and it is that quality that she offers. But at this price, $24.99, can I just pick these up and show you? Look at you're getting three of these beautiful little they they're sort of like fairies, but there's there's such a lovely movement. They're balaic. So that just by itself, I if you want to turn that into a bracelet, how wonderful would that be? So you've got the fairies, you're getting three of those. We've got our wings, which we showed as well, which I, I love. Now that could be an earring, it could be uh, a little charm. So you've got your uh, wings. Look at these, Venetian masks. Ah, oh, love that. Again, lovely charm size. Uh, you've got your dragonfly in the mix too. We love our dragonfly. Then we've got, and we saw Jane using this to great effect in the last inspiration, that wonderful heart, steampunk, love it. This is interesting. Got your lock in there as well. That's something very different, getting three of those. And you're getting your flower in the mix too. Three of those. So you're getting an awful lot for $24.99. And some of the inspirations that you can see in front of me here, showing you the versatility, whether we want to use it in our mixed media makes, whether you want to use it for jewelry. Uh, it's uh, 470 your item number. Uh, we've also got our strands. Uh, they are glass beads. You're getting 1,100 in total. And they're just a perfect way to add to your stash. The fact that they're glass beads, it says something. So you feel the quality. Glass beads, just add those strands into your mix and then it's up to you the direction you want to take them. You could create something like that. Whoo hoo, that is stunning. Gotta move on, only because we wanna get back to demonstration. I'll just give you the details. 19.99 your price, uh, 487.159 your item number. And finally, we have our jump rings to show you. These have been very popular. So you're getting three sets in total. All three of these. Your silver, ooh. Getting your silver there, and a half the stock has gone here. Twenty-two ninety-nine your price, six nine eight seven four one your item number. I hope you're enjoying the show. Any questions? Do feel free to get in touch. Let's go onto our website. It's a great way to shop ahead. What are you going to pop into your basket? Should we show you how to shop by brand? Because it is really simple to do. So if you do have a brand that you love, just say Aldridge. So we're just looking for A. Uh, you don't need to type out the full word. So just A, and there we go. Aldridge Crafts and then all the goodies that Jane brings. There is a lot on the website that we haven't, uh, we're not featuring on the show, but you can still purchase. So we've got a lot on our website, so do feel free to check that out. Okay, so what are we gonna do next then, Jane? Uh, we're gonna make the little chain bracelet uh, with the little Venetian masks on it, perhaps. See, so. They're perfect for like little charms. And, yes, yeah. yeah. Like um, but before we go on to that, I just wanted to show you another little element I'd made out of the little findings. Is my I, I, I call him my steampunk jellyfish. That's nice. But just little, whoops, he's got a 
little addition on the bottom, but just to show you how can simple, you yeah, you how simple, and you can, they make quite nice, quite good fun earrings as well, just a little bit of chain, a couple of little components out of the kit. Oh, that looks awesome. Just good fun. We like that. I do like the cord too. I personally, I like wearing cord and it's good for guys and girls. Yes. Yeah. Definitely. Okay. So uh, we're going to make um, the, the chain bracelet that we mm -hmm. have. And I always like the way you really use your board to good effect, the way you're able to separate everything out. It does, out, it helps. Out. Yeah, definitely, because you can sort of work out and get a plan of what you're going to use where. As I was saying, if I'm doing necklaces, you can use the curve mm -hmm. of the board as well. So it's a really handy bit of kit, and it's got that sort of velvety finish yeah. to it. So, so that if you have got little components, around. yeah, these are, don't roll around quite so much. So yeah. what I've done is I've, I've um, shortened sort of three lengths of our chain, and mm -hmm. just to show you how easy it is to... to change the length of the chain you can if I wanted to add some more onto this I could mm -hmm. so if I wanted to just take a couple of links off mm -hmm. um, the links all open so what I'm going to do is get two pairs of pliers with a with a flat end mm -hmm. so and you're just going to grasp that link and just turn it at right angles so if you turn it at right angles mm -hmm. that opens that link so it has unattached yeah. those sections. Now, if I wanted to add a little bit more on, you just do the same. Mm -hmm. And all of the chains work that way, so you can adjust them to what length you want and there's mm -hmm. no waste. So what I'm going to do is, is uh, make a multicolour oh, nice. um, piece. Because like um, I think it's quite fun to mix the colours. So I've picked out some larger rings from, mm -hmm. from my jump ring set. And again, we open these exactly the same way. So they've always got a little gap in them. Yeah. So if you can't so quite see it, if you just run your finger around, you can you just feel the that. edge. Okay. okay, and then... I tend to use mine at right angles, but you mm -hmm. can go in this way. It's yeah, whatever comfortable okay. angle you yeah, are. Works, and then yeah. just I twist my wrist, and that then nice. opens that loop. Now, there's a big reason why we twist as opposed to pulling apart, because if you twist, you're not altering the actual shape exactly. once you lock it up. If you do pull it apart, then it's never going to be It's still retaining out. that circular shape. Yeah. So, um, mm -hmm. yeah, so we can then hook on our mm -hmm. chain. So I'm just going to sort of have a joining point on here nice. to gather all our chain together. And do you know, it's really nice being able to make jewellery that fits us because a problem, having a chat with Chris, our director, and he was saying that he struggles with wearing bracelets, guys, in yep. the past because he's got really thin wrists. Oh, okay. And yes. so they're always, they're yeah. always really big, so he always has to get yeah, them altered. Yeah, I have altered. exactly the same issue. I've okay. got teeny tiny wrists. Yeah. So if any mm -hmm. sort of commercial jewellery that I buy yeah. is just way too big. Yeah, yeah. I always remember once okay. I got bought a beautiful link. Uh, bracelet for my birthday yeah. and the jewel uh -huh. had to take out about a third of the links to get it to fit me and it seems such a waste yeah. <laughs> well, you want it to fit because if it's flopping around yeah then you're, you're likely to lose it uh, speaking of bracelets just a reminder for uh, the benefit of anyone who might have just tuned in that we are celebrating the fact that Aldridge Crafts are eight years old and we have got a birthday gift now it's only while stocks last and we've had a busy show so I can't say uh, how long we're gonna have that bonus gift at the moment we do still have stock anybody makes a purchase you don't need to add a code it's just automatically added into your basket or why well, say into your basket into your uh your packaging so when it arrives into your box you're going to get this wonderful bracelet kit to make up now colors may vary but this is the bracelet that you're going to make it up. is it's so beautiful. we've got all different rainbow colors lovely mm -hmm. little elasticated bracelet so yeah. again you can make it to to fit your size plenty. we've been generous with the beads so that yeah. if you've got a larger wrist you know it's plenty of beads there so just a little heart detail as well I mean, that's just a lovely little i mean what would you what would you be paying for that bracelet kit if you were to buy it separately? Well, I sell the kits uh, for five pounds four ninety nine in the shop, um, just to so sort of make them on their own. All right, so let, let's just think about this because anything you purchase, you're going to be getting that added to your order. It is one per customer, but in effect, you can take five pounds off the price uh, there because obviously that's worth five pounds and you're getting it for free. Yeah, amazing. A little thank you from us. Well, thank you. <laughs> That's right, I've just managed to loop an extra bit in, but that's fine. Okay. I can just undo that and redo that again. There we go, that's better. So this is just sort of gathering us, sort of giving us some joining spots. Nice. Um, so that we're not fighting with sort of three bits of chain. Mm -hmm. And even if you do this just temporarily and decide at the end you actually want to remove them, it just helps yeah. you with your um, working. So what I'm okay. going to do is just sort of twist this around a little because mm -hmm. I want to try and form it so that we get some twists yeah. in the chain. Give it a bit of character. Yeah, so I'm switching to a different colour ring here because if you're using different colour metals, go, go all out, mm. you know, really sort of make it a feature. Well, this is where we've got that option with the three sets of jump rings, you know, the different uh, yes. in their own story. 
storage, uh, which has been very popular. So that, to me, uh, am I right in saying, Jane? I mean, that's a real staple. Any yeah. anyone who makes jewellery uh, will benefit from those. Yes. Now there is a freedom price, but let's just say that's your only purchase this hour. You will then save a further five pounds if you factor in you're getting the bracelet kit in your order. And we still have stock for now. I will tell you if that changes. So 2069, you're saving money. Take a fiver off that for your bracelet kit that's going to be added into your order. You're getting a great price on those uh, jump rings there. Okay. And two thirds of stock have gone there. Sorry. I'm just starting to sort of mm -hmm. loop this through and sometimes I'm going through all three strands, sometimes I'm going just through two. So it gives that little bit of movement, yeah. a bit of sort of uh, flexibility. The other thing you can do as well is plait the chain okay, nice. so that you get a really nice twist on it. Yeah. But if you sort of miss a loop on one, then catch it on the next one so that it sort of gathers it all together. Yeah. And again, because um, you, you know, it's your design. Mm -hmm. You can add as many or as few elements as you want. So if you want to keep it quite simple and just perhaps have a big feature charm and then perhaps more of the little charms on, yeah. you do can it. do. But if you want a really full bracelet, mm -hmm. if you've treated yourself to sort of um, the sort of mixed media kit, you can sort of add lots of little elements on as well. Yeah. Really go to town. Lovely. So you can see it's ever so easy to do. Just mm -hmm. capture that in. Oops, I missed the loop there. Let's try that again. There we go. Okay. I've had a look at you working, Jane, and I see that this is your happy place. Oh, always. You enjoy it, right? Anything creative, and I'm there. Did you ever think when you started your shop, because again, we are celebrating mm. the 8th birthday, that you'd be here now, sat on TV, demonstrating? Definitely not. Oh. Definitely not. It's, it's such a fantastic experience, and I always love coming on. Oh, good. And you can see it. And you bring us such really nice inspirations as well. But I think that's the thing, is when you are creative, you know, that it, it does, it sends you to your happy place. And I think mm -hmm. especially when you have got lots of things going on to distract mm -hmm. you, yeah. you can go and go into your happy place. Well, it's nice. Just take some time out, clear the mind. Yes. Yes, I have a I have a day of painting mm -hmm. planned tomorrow. Doing oh, some lovely. abstract art painting tomorrow. Oh, wow. So now can we follow you on social media? So we can. You do, do you yeah. post pictures of your makes? I do. Oh, do. Right. How, do how do we do it? Uh, just search Roderick Crafts, yeah. and I'll pop up on all the popular social media. Oh, so oh, yeah, brilliant. come and come and find me and see. Please do that. See an interesting yeah. mix of things that I do. So Aldrich Craft, not just jewellery though. Jane does make the most beautiful jewellery, but she loves all arts. Tomorrow it's going to be a mixed media day, some abstract abstract art. Mm -hmm. uh, she'll post pictures. So if you do follow Jane Aldrich. Uh, crafts, social media, all popular social mm -hmm. media, and it's well worth it. So, mm -hmm. we're sort of getting to finish sort of half of the bracelet here, and okay. then obviously we can then go into our starter kit yeah. and add on our, our jewellery findings as well. Mm. So, you can see that I'm sort of starting to form a pattern with there. Yeah. But one thing I like with jewellery is obviously if I'm, you know, if you're doing uh, card making and yeah. You know, if once your hit ink has hit the paper, it's hit the paper, and and you're sort of committed to you're some you're extent. True. Whereas with jewellery, if there's an element on there I'm not quite happy with, so I can take it apart. No harm, no You know, foul. change the angles, yeah. and just get it sort of looking a little differently. Mm -hmm. But no. that's really starting to come together now it and is. give me a really good mixture. I hope you're enjoying the show. Now we were just talking about the starter kit, so uh, we have got our. This is kind of like our foundation, our uh, jewellery tray. And then you've also, or design board, I should say. Uh, and then we have got all our findings in there as well. So, a great way to get started. So, you're getting your finder starter kit with your design board, $14.99 your price, $289.495 your item number. Now, actually, design board is the perfect description because you've got all your measurements there. But I've seen you work with this, Jane, mm -hmm. and you like to plan out mm -hmm. your design. So, you'll lay, say, uh, your chain up there, mm -hmm. you'll put elements through and see what works and what doesn't exactly. work. Exactly, yeah. You yeah. can play around with your layout, sort of as, you know, mm -hmm. as much as you want changing different elements and getting it all balanced out. Yeah, we like that. Okay, so uh, lots to play around with. Uh, tell you what, should we have a look at the owls? Mm. Should we do something with the owls? We can do, okay. yes. We're going to have a look at the owls. Now, uh, remember, we've got lots on the show. Just going to do, should I tell you what, we'll just show you some popular items as well. Let you get set, Jane. No problem. So uh, this is the design board. 
having a little look. So with your design board, you're not only getting that, but you are getting the uh, Finding Starter Kit as well and the storage. But remember, $14.99, if that's your only purchase today, it is one per customer. You also get the bonus gift, a bracelet kit worth $4.99. So effectively, that means that starter kit is now down to uh, $10 or oh, $9.99. Uh, so for 289-495, your item number. Well, it's got the jump rings. Now we are three quarters of the stock gone here with our jump rings. I, I don't want to sound like a broken record, but this is a staple. So uh, if you are making one purchase, and this is your only purchase this hour, factor in, you're getting the, uh, the bracelet kit worth 4 dollars which means that £20.69, take a fiver off that effectively, just over £15, you're getting all three of those and the starter kit. Uh, 698-741, your item number. Well, I say starter kit, the bracelet kit, sorry. Uh, we've also got here, now this is your uh, Aldrich Craft steampunk themed jewellery. Ooh! And your mixed media embellishments. We are limited stock, everybody. Uh, so if you do want to get hold of this, we've only got 10% of our stock remaining, and it looks like it's going to be a sellout. So if you do want to get hold of it, now is the time. Uh, one more. We've got a statement pendants. As the name suggests, these are your showstoppers. They are such beautiful designs. We saw uh, Jane working with the uh, wonderful masks, so the masquerade ball masks. You've got those wonderful fairies in there, the hearts with the wings, the dragonflies, the wings by themselves, the flowers, the lock keys, all of those, $24.99, 470 your item number. So we've got our owls here, we have. and they are stunning. And you've got, I know we've got, this, I mean, this one is lovely, but you've also got the the larger, sort of real statement owls. Yes. And we had a couple of examples. So what we'll do, Jamie, if you could just pass the owls, please, buddy. Thank you. Can, do you mind if I just reach across you, Jamie? Yes, I'm sure. Because that, to me, that is such a statement owl. Thank you. So look at that. Now you are getting two of these. You're going to get the pink and the blue, but not only that. Now this little fella here. Well, I say little. It's not little at all. Stunning. So you, look, even if you've just started making jewellery, because you've got the chain in there, that is a very easy make, but my goodness, that looks good. I think that is a fantastic piece. Really do. It's quite a sort of fantasy owl as yeah. well, I think. He so if you like all your mystical sort of dragons yeah. and things like that, he's... I totally agree. Or you know somebody who likes a, a well-known book where they use yes. owls a lot? Yes. Yeah. Definitely. Okay. So I thought I would mm -hmm. incorporate a little owl with a couple of little elements from our other kits. Mm -hmm. And so um, we can add that all together. So I'm going to go with a silver chain this time. Mm -hmm. Oops, I've got all of a tangle. There we go. Okay. So again, like how with our other linked chain, we can just shorten mm -hmm. that okay. in the same way. So hold yeah. on to that with your flat pliers and just twist it sideways to open that link. Very easy to, uh, to get the right length. Yeah. Okay, so let's get some silver jump rings. Mm -hmm. So what's nice about these as well is if you craft on the go, mm -hmm. you've got everything to hand and yeah. not got lots of little packets everywhere and mm -hmm. keeps everything all neat and tidy. Yeah. So we're going to put our our element right at the bottom. Mm -hmm. So back again with our jump rings. Lovely. Little twist. Yeah. And what's nice as well is if you're, if you, I've got a little bit of a shake on my hands, so mm. I use the board to steady myself, so I can lean on and lean my my hands on the board. Mm. And you can see now that gives me a bit of stability. It's good to. So I then take my components yeah. to my jump ring. Lovely. Great tip there, Jane. Yeah. I have shaky hands before I get nervous. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> so that then, we've got our little um, oh, pal nice. added on yeah, already. Move him down a little bit. There so we go. This is showing how you do start building up your design with yes. your design board. Now, on something like this, if I want to um, get it even, a little mm -hmm. handy hint again for you is if you take just, um, I always use a head pin. Mm -hmm. um, if you want to get your um, uh, elements positioned an exact space away to keep mm -hmm. it nice and symmetrical, um, I tend to use my, my head pin as a marker. So okay. I'll go say uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, and I'll pop that through there. And that way, it doesn't matter how much you move your chain, you know exactly where you want to put that link through. Nice. 
because otherwise you tend to pick it up and think, was it this one? Was it that one? Mm -hmm. So by now I know I can pick that up, I can just slot that out, loop my loop through, and that's in the right spot. Got to tell you that we've had the first of sellouts, and we knew we were going to have sellouts to sell. So our steampunk themed uh, bundle, you're seeing it right here. So you're getting the jewelry, uh, theme jewelry, and your media, uh, mixed media embellishments. I'm afraid that has sold out. Uh, it's completely gone, not even technical sellout. It is gone, gone. Three, four, five, six. Mm -hmm. I'm glad you're having a busy show for your birthday show. Yes. Celebrations. Mm -hmm. And can I just take the time while I'm busy doing this, mm -hmm. just to send a uh, sort of quick recovery message to one of my friends who had a bit of a stumble yesterday. Oh, so, no. um, Andrea, if you're watching, I hope that you're not too achy today. Oh, bless you, Andrea. I'm feeling better. Oops, I putting up a fight, that one. Mm -hmm. Oops, no, we'll start again. Okay. Let's turn the wrong angle, but that's fine. Okay. So we go back again with our head pin. Okay. So we're one, two, three, four, five, six, that one. So in everything you've been showing, I'm conscious of the fact that whatever level of crafter we are, these are all achievable. I mean, even yeah. if you've just, this could be your start of a new hobby for you and you're looking to explore your own jewelry making, you can do this. But the real, I mean, this taps into why I love crafting. It is that personal touch and being able to create something that is truly original. And this looks stunning. It really does look it's good. It's coming together nicely now. Yeah. So I think, what do you think? The key's in the middle? Could or the other side? I think the other side. The other side? Yeah, Put it this let's side? Do the other side, yeah. So again, we can count a few. Mm -hmm. So one, two, three, four, five this time. I didn't get my jump ring ready. Get your jump okay. ring ready first. <laughs> Getting ahead of myself now. Okay. Got four minutes. Ah, fabulous. So we go back in again. We've got one, two, three, four, five. Yep. Jump ring ready. Lovely. And then pop our little key charm on. Beautiful. I do love those little key charms, yeah. as you can probably tell. They're just a good little sort of fill-in mm. detail on your pieces. But even by themselves, they have character. Yeah. And they're so delicate. Yeah. So I open my jump ring ready. Now, all the jewellery that you've made on the show, mm -hmm. I can imagine, you you put some tissue paper, maybe you uh, love all sorts of crafts, so you can make your own boxes, mm -hmm. so if you uh, do like your paper crafting, make a beautiful box, oh we've got the tins actually, nice uh, mm -hmm. way to display it, bit of tissue paper, a nice box, and suddenly you give that as a gift to somebody, my goodness it looks expensive. And the thing is it's bespoke made for somebody yeah. as well, so. which always makes it that bit extra special. Oh, I totally agree, it shows you're thinking about them. And actually, you give someone something that whenever they wear it, they'll think about you. Yes, mm. yes, that's very much so. I think when we do look through our jewellery box, you do tend to remember those who have given you the different pieces. Mm. So there we go. We've now got... That looks... I think, can we just piece? put we that can. on here? You I'm just going to take... Just I love put, this Let's out. put a little link on the back okay. so that you can hook it together. Nice. Just for speed. Mm -hmm. Easier said actually, than done, though. No, okay. <laughs> but this showing, Jane, you know, you mentioned earlier that it's so easy to, you can change lengths, you can uh, take elements out, yep. put elements in. So if I suddenly decide, actually, I want to wear this as a really long necklace mm -hmm. over a sort of chunky jumper, Sorry. I can just adjust the length of my chain. There we go. Have a look. So now you get the idea how we've suddenly created our own jewellery, our own work of art that we get to play. And that's nice because we're using, uh, it does showcase how everything on the show just plays so nicely mm -hmm. together. If you do love the owls, so that owl uh, from our uh, owl collection, you are getting this owl. You're also getting this owl in the mix as well. Mm -hmm. You're getting two of the large sort of pendant owls, the pink one and the red one. You're getting more owls in the mix as well. You're getting enameled owls. So 
when you think about it, value for money, 37.48, you're also saving 12 pounds 50. Mm -hmm. And forget the owls, I mean, just the chain alone, the amount of chain yeah. that you're yeah, getting. Yeah, and we all use so much chain, so it's such a yeah. good addition to your stash. I think so. It has been an absolute pleasure, Jane. Uh, when, are you, when are you back next? I'm back in May. Okay, mm -hmm. all right, brilliant. Well, we look forward to that. Uh, also, if social media, we talked about following yes, you on social come media. Find me. Aldrich Crafts, it's worth doing, and I'm sure if somebody at home makes something they're proud of, you'd love to see oh, it. Oh, please do, yes, yeah. please share it. I'd love tag, to see them. Send it to Jane. Uh, also, please tag her Chandrian because we love seeing it as well. Uh, so, uh, if you've got anything in your basket, do make sure to check out. I'll, I'll say why. I, I'm tentative for saying because. I'm happy, look, if you want it in your basket, if you want to purchase it, I'm not going to force you to, no pressure sales here at Hochanda. The only reason I mention it is because we have got uh, that bonus gift and we are getting towards the end of our stock there. And once it's gone, uh, we had limit stock and it's literally first come, first served basis. There's a bonus mm -hmm. gift. At the moment, we still have stock, but it really is running low. Uh, so, uh, and because of the end of the show, I can't give you updates. So it will be a first come, first served basis. If you have got anything in your basket, if you really want it, make sure to check out. You're also getting that bonus gift worth $4.99, our basic kit. Thank you so much. Thank Jane. you. Really enjoyed it. Yes, uh, fun. I hope you will stick with us. If you want to re-watch this hour, revisit it, you can do it on our website or Hochanda app. Thanks, Jane. Thank you. So Maggie and Kay are here. Cool Cat Crafts coming up next. Going to be an awesome hour. Then we are knitting with sardines for tea. Amazing hour. I cannot wait for that. After that, another look at our one day special, Clever Prints with Emma. Hi, I'm Lou from Studio Light. Studio Light has been around for about 40 years now. They're based in the Netherlands. It's a family run business with a great heritage. The products that Studio Light bring us are very diverse, fantastic dyes, great papers, but all round on trend. Over the 40 years, Studio Light have evolved. They listen to me, the demonstrator, and you, the customers, and really take our ideas on board. On the Achanda shows, we'll share with you the diverse techniques and products will inspire you to produce your own individual pieces of artwork. So make sure you don't miss the studio light shows on Achanda. Calling all the Chanda viewers. We have some exciting news for you. From the 1st of April, we will have a new schedule for our one day special shows. The one day special will now be shown live at 6 pm and 8 pm, followed by 8 am, 12 pm, and the final call at 4 pm the following day. This means that following your feedback, when we have a special two hour launch of the one day special at 5 pm and 6 pm, both hours will be available live to our free view viewers. So join us from the 1st of April for our new exciting one day special schedule, only on Achanda. Hello, I'm Sue Trangmar and I started Daisy Chain Designs 20 years ago. Back in the day, there were very few quilt patterns in the marketplace. And so uh, I started to bring patterns into the UK from America and Australia. And along the way, I've been lucky enough to work with some fantastic British designers. And that is what really the essence of Daisy Chain Designs are. At Daisy Chain Designs, we're passionate about sewing and quilting. We design projects that hopefully will inspire you to pick up your needle and thread and have a go. Uh, we have great fun in designing things from the very start, and then the end product is always very exciting when you actually see it made. So don't miss the Daisy Chain Design shows on Hachanda. Good morning. Hello. 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 Morning, everybody. Good morning. <laughs> First, Cool Cats Crafts is the company that Maggie and Kay have put together, bringing amazing products from storage to amazing albums and dice, and that is what we are featuring today. Yes, that's yeah. right. Okay. Yeah. Right. So. Kay is going to be doing the first demo. So, so shall, shall we? Oh, well, well how, what have you got planned for us? Uh, I'm, I'm going to do some substrate. So we've got craft plastic. We've got some graphic art stuff. So we've got some craft plastic and some Duralar. Both are brilliant. 
So well, have fabulous. Play those. Now, so we'll let you get okay. on with that, and then we'll keep Maggie with us. Uh, well, because we want to see exactly what we have got in store for you. Okay. Now, we are going to start with a mini drop side box black album kit. Now, what do we get here? Okay, right. So this is a new album kit design that okay. we've done, yeah. which means you can actually create um, <coughs> a mini if drop side it, yeah. album. Yeah. So when you open it. That's yeah. what it says on the tin, the sides uh, drop okay. down, and then you've got your pages here. These are pocket pages. Uh, yeah. Now, this kit is different because it actually has a new format of pages for you, which mm -hmm. are pre-cut and pre-scored, so it makes the album-making journey much, much easier okay. and also much, much quicker. All right. You get a full set of instructions. You get your pre-cut grey board. You actually get six pre-cut and scored pages. Okay. This has got five in here, but okay. there's six if you want to do six. Fabulous. Or it's if you make a mistake. That's then you get open. your A4 black yeah. card to go with it. It's top quality, 260 GSM black card from Pink Frog, so, so you know the quality. We know the quality, and of course, being pre scored so it makes it uh, much easier. Well, especially if it's you are a beginner, of, yes. sometimes you want yeah. to have the. Now, of course, uh, so we have got the instructions in here, yeah. and of course, we have got the card here pre scored yeah. you can see it. We have got also the um, precision cut grey board to, yeah. to actually create your box album sides and covers. You've got Architape, which uh, is yeah. our professional book binding tape. Which is that, uh, yeah. You've got um, 12 neodymium magnets, uh -huh. which are perfect if you want to create flaps, pockets, so, things like that. So they are super strong, but they are very, very, very thin. strong, very thin. So you won't really notice yeah. them in the page. And also you get a one sheet of double, extra strong double-sided adhesive for attaching your spine to yes. the actual cover. Okay, and yeah. that will give it not only the adhesive, but also so much strength to yes. it. Yes, yeah. and it's everything's acid-free. Acid Fabulous. That's yeah. a very. I love that you mentioned that because, yeah. of course, uh, you know, acid free is important when you are doing memory uh, memory albums and things like that. Now, of course, you just need your own papers and decorations, and yes, of course, you, you can. And if you get in touch with us, if you go onto our Cool Cats Facebook group, you'll see lots of different album examples. But you can also email us and get in touch, and we can send you what we call page layouts, page maps. Ah, so they'll show you different ideas. Fabulous. They won't give you the decorative paper measurements but you'll get an idea of how to do it. Fabulous. And you can always get in touch with us and we'll help. Excellent. Uh, if you want to go for the mini drop side box black album kit, your item number is 324017. It's £27.99. Pence. Now, I'm, I'm right to think that, of course, you have got the instructions here. Yeah. So, for instance, if you want to know how to cut chipboard with precision, yeah. could yeah. they do that? Do they, they could do, yes. Yeah. So but the measurements for the grey board aren't in the instructions. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh, all right. So, so yeah. Um, and to, uh, when we first bought our album kits, yeah. you used to, I used to do them for yeah. Oakwood Archer and you used to have to put, cut yeah. the grey board yourself. People struggled with it so much yeah. and now because we um, we have a laser meister yeah. who cuts all our stuff yeah. for us, so um, it's much easier and it's easier for everybody else. Absolutely it is. So <coughs> there you have it. It is a fabulous uh, mini box album. And I also think now we have got the cream option yes. here. Yeah. Now is it the same finish size? It's the same finished size. The difference is you don't have pre-cut and scored okay. pages here. So here you're using your traditional 12 by 12 mm -hmm. cardstock. This is um, 280 GSM cardstock and it's cream. You've got a beautiful dark red architect yeah. with it. This one's actually decorated with Catherine Sturrock's uh, vintage yeah. sheet collection. So if you've got that, perfect to use that. Again, it comes with the magnets, the instructions, the double-sided adhesive. Lots of the little pockets and flaps you can see are using yeah. our Cool Cats okay, the dies, yeah. which you'll find on the website. There's a whole yeah. range of them there. But um, of course, it's the beautiful yeah. thing about this is that it's a box. And, it's yeah. and also, I think that for me, um, I'm thinking if you have got memorabilia and you can... You can store it. You can, you can make an additional it. pocket there. Absolutely. Do whatever a you 3D, like. A 3D. Yes. Uh, sorry. Yeah. There you have it. Yeah. There you have it. You can see there. And you could have it in that side as well, yeah. so you have because you have got a little bit of a space. If I close it like that, you can see it. It's exactly. quite a lot actually. You can pop yeah, quite yeah, a lot it in is. There. Yes. Now, of course, you are getting a 12 by 12 cream in there as well, and the instructions. Your item number is six eight one nine zero six. Of course, twenty seven pounds and ninety nine pence is your price. Then we go into, of course, uh, we have got another option as well, another yes. uh, in different format. Right, this is a different format. Now, this is to actually make um, an eight by L. 8x8 eight eight album. Yeah. Okay, so the actual cover itself will be 8 inches by 8 inches. With this kit, you get your archetype, you get your pre cut and scored pages. Uh, okay. Oh, really? You get, yeah, you get your magnets and you get A4 card as well and some double sided adhesive tape. So 
this is for you to start out, make a complete blank journal yourself and then decorate it how you choose. Uh -huh. So you can see them here. Yeah. And then kind of close it up, yep. and there you have it. And that's really nice. I think this is really stylish as well. So it imagine is. decorating it with yeah. your own papers, or you're creating your backgrounds. And uh, now, of course, that is your eight by eight album kit with pre-scored pages, and of course, the, all the uh, different elements that you are going to need. Look at that. It has got also a Freedom Members Prize, twenty-five pounds and nineteen pence. Now, we have got, of course, uh, the dice that will cut for, you know, like the, the Mac, Mac, uh, Mac Pop, Mac pop, pop dice. dice. I so would say Mac Pie. But you can say <laughs> Mac Pie, but it's a Mac <laughs> Pop, yes. Yeah, um, and of course, that is the starter kit. So to, uh, yes, so this is really, if you're s just starting out on your album journey mm -hmm. and you want to make some decorative pages, what we've done is we've um, put together a little kit with um, a set of our never-ending strip dies. Yeah. They're called that because they don't have cutting edges, yeah. which means you can make the... Um, die cut as long as you want yeah. but it's just to give you decorative edges for your flaps yeah. little, little cut-ins things like that makes your journey much easier but it's a non-threatening way of starting out yeah. if you're just starting out and you think oh I'm not really sure what to do this is a perfect yeah. set just to work with and you also get your mag pop die okay. which is a little round circle die with an embossed okay, center I'm gonna show it to which you which I think you can uh, see on there that that's one? it yeah Okay, so and you've got a meter of architect with yep. this, so you can die cut the mag pop out with your architect, peel it back, you put your magnet in the little mm -hmm. deboss center, stick it down, so it just holds it all in place. Yeah. You don't need to use architect with yeah. your mag pop, yeah. but we just put it in, and um, that's what we tend to use now. Yeah. It gives you a really nice finish. And it does. I mean, <coughs> yesterday when you were, we were so showing, I really, really enjoyed how it's. And you would yeah. use it uh, like a bone folder, what yes. your teflon, yeah, tool, use our teflon to, tool to, yeah. to varnish it. For fourteen pounds and ninety nine pence, it's an amazing value for money. Trust me. That it's I was very, very busy uh, last night. It, it, two thirds of the stock has already gone, and of course you are going to have those dice time and time again. And of course you have got the the new. Dium, 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 Dium,
to um, so you can put a ring through yeah. and hold them all together. Perfect. And of okay. course, and the ring is included the as well. The ring is included so as well. You have got there all yep. your tools in that ring binder. Perfect. Over half of the stock now has gone. Of the stock has gone. One zero six seven four five is your item number. Twenty four pounds and ninety nine pence. Then we have got the journal kit. Now this one I can see lots of beautiful mm -hmm. samples with this one. So we have got. What do we get You've here? You've got Mike? two journals here, okay. two different sizes. So both so, sizes. So both sizes yeah. are here. Okay. They're cut in MDF. You get your spines as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You get two meters of elastic cord. Mm -hmm. You get two meters of hinge tape. Okay. Kay actually showed a demonstration last night how okay. to put it together. So the last night would be a Friday, the twentieth. Uh, twentieth. 7 p.m. 7 PM. PM. So yeah. if you are, if you want to watch our re on rewind mm -hmm. on the website, you can um, catch it up. Yeah. Now we actually gave one to Emma to have a little play yeah. with, and she's been playing with it. I think oh. she used it on her yeah, nine o'clock show. Yeah. What she really likes about these journal covers is the rounded corners. Yeah. Because we've really? we've tried to do it so yeah. they're really nice. Yeah. You can see that really yeah. nice and smooth. But you, then you can do whatever you like with them. One of them comes with ten sheets of cartridge paper. Mm -hmm. The other one comes with 10 sheets of pre-scored watercolour yeah. card, which the watercolour one will fit into the smaller journal and the cartridge paper into the larger Perfect. one. And then, of course, you have got the, the yeah. card in here as well. Yeah. So if you have a, just have a look through. So this is the larger one. Okay. And here, Yvonne's done this, and she's just done it as a sort of photo journal. Yeah. Some of the pictures she's taken, she's popped other things yeah. in. She's actually used some of our dyes in there. Yeah. So yeah. That's, that's that one there. Yeah. Then we've got this one here that Jane has done, and this is a record of all her um, garden um, background techniques. Yeah. Oh, that's fabulous. Which is clever, isn't it? So, so you can see the different yeah. techniques in there. And another. Mm. Look at that. That's fabulous. Yeah. And then this is a smaller one. Oh, uh, yeah. has done this, and this is yeah. just your garden one, garden notes, things to do. And then yeah. she's just started it out like that, so you that's can take fabulous. pictures of your garden yeah, and how your flowers are doing. Yeah, this is really all sorts lovely. Of things. And it feels so sturdy. Of course, it's MDF yeah. the base and, and there. So you, your item number is nine zero seven seven eight zero. Is of course for the set of two. Uh, of course, remember that you have got two different sizes in there. MDF journal kits, nineteen pounds and ninety nine pence. And also think about all the things that you, all the different techniques mm. you can throw at doing. You the can MDF. do so much you with can these. Do it. Yeah. And then of course. We have got the craft plastic, the substrate bundle, which includes the craft plastic and the dural lar. Now, Kay was telling me more yeah. about this. Kay is going to be demoing these because yeah. this is her baby, really. Mm -hmm. These are fabulous substrates. And a substrate is basically anything yeah. you can put your paints, your mediums. Yeah, and okay. of course, uh, one of the things I have used the Duralar for a while now, and I have to say that I also mix lovely um, blank hearts. I sometimes use yes. them. I mean, of course, it is very thin, but it still is just so beautiful. But it's box. strong it as is, well. That's yeah. the other thing. So with your Duralar, you can actually make perfect. Um, if you've got your yeah. battery tea lights. Oh and yeah, things. exactly. That's okay. that's one of the but things. If you have a look here, yeah. let me just find um, the right page. I think it's the second one. Is it the second one? Yeah, there's one. Isn't it this one? Yeah, I'm just looking for the other one. Is, so is you can see the page, translucentness. Yeah, okay. So that's that there. Yeah. And then a bit further down. Yeah. I'm just looking, I think it's on here. I'm just looking for the This is it. Yeah. Okay, right. So that one here yeah. is with your Duralar. Yeah. Okay. This one here is with your alcohol inks oh. with your craft plastic. Okay. Wow. Now, I have to say the craft plastic, right. it's 12 by 12 sheet. Yeah. Alcohol inks is absolutely Fabulous. brilliant, but you can um, you can do cards with it. You can heat you can heat it and, and shape, shape it. it. So if you're cutting flowers from your craft plastic, it's perfect. You can heat emboss on it. Oh, look um, at that! There's and loads it does you can have that do. strength to it, a different yeah. feel to it. But then look at this. I mean, he has lost his wing. Oh, um, he had an acci accident in transit. Yeah. But this is a little bee, actually done in yeah. Duralar, yeah. and how. Uh, there it is. That's it. That's there, it. There. He flew away yeah. then. And how how beautiful is that? You really can see every every aspect of the that, bee stamp. Yes, That's yeah. just stamped onto it. And then and cut out. You can die cut it as well. Um, uh, it's, it really. I mean, I can vouch for the Duralar because I can <coughs> I have used it so much and it's just fabulous. Of course, you are getting the both the Duralar and the craft plastic. And the item number is nine zero seven zero four seven. Your price is thirty three pounds and ninety eight pence, making a saving of six pounds. And let's have some inspiration on what you can do with these products.
And of course, we are back. And Kay is going to show us how to uh, use the craft plastic, I, I believe. I, I am, yes. Yeah. So, was it the journal I did yesterday was this one. Yeah. And then you fold your watercolour card yeah. in there. So, that's how your journal goes. But you can okay. also put other um, substrates in there, okay. so papers and what have you. So, the craft plastic comes in 12 by 12 sheets. Okay. Yeah. And you get 25 in a pack. Mm -hmm. And the jewel pack is a great value. All right. It's a really good value. And this is a jewel line. Is this the one you've been working yes, with? Yes, I have it in the yeah. It's jewel line I love jewel line uh, yeah. And it's, it's, uh, it's a really sturdy material. And, and I love it because it's translucent. It's like, almost like vellum it, it in is. acetate and form. Yeah. And, you, and basically, you can sit there and you just yeah. stroke it. It feels just so yeah. smooth. It does. It's fantastic. Anyway, so, and then what I've done is cut yeah. them to fit my... Yeah. my journal. Okay. Okay. Fabulous. So this is the craft plastic, because it's uh, yeah. the opaque white craft mm. plastic and this is a jewel art and yep. I'm going to stamp some Im images on okay. here yep. and you're and I'm going to colour them in mm -hmm. with pencil yep. so on an artificial surface like polystar yep. uh, polythene you yep. can't normally colour in with um, pencils yep. but you can okay. with this so I'm using Stazon okay. ink because it's on a non-porous surface and I want it to dry quite quickly and I'm going to stamp mm -hmm. this one first Okay, I'll just put him on there. So this is a journal one. I'm just doing practicing techniques. Okay. So go in. So I just stamp that one on. I love this stamp. It's a Stampantius one that Maggie yep. had on a little while ago. Okay, what I'm going to do this one, I'm going to do this one landscape, mm -hmm. and I'm going to have the um, mm -hmm. chickens facing uh, yeah. each other. Okay. Oh, uh, I see. Because jewel is see-through, yeah. you can see through from the other side. Yeah. So anything you put on the back of it, you can see through. Uh, yeah. So you, can get, you get a depth. Yeah. But you can also, they could be looking at each other. Okay. So we're going to stamp this one like that. Okay. Okay. Oops, I just moved it. Never mind. And I'm just going to blot it. Yeah. Okay. And then I'm going to open that up and I'm going to turn that around. Ah. I've turned it over. Yeah. So I stamped it like that. I'm going to turn yeah. it over. And then I'm going to stamp it again. Yeah. Ah. Facing yeah. so they can be like having a conversation. Ah. So when you, I'll just block that because I want to colour it. So you can colour both ways and you end up okay. with them facing each other yep. and they look so you stamp them twice I mm -hmm. love this material you can do so yeah, much yeah you this. can do yeah absolutely indeed. brilliant so you can colour this in so what I'm going to do two, two colouring techniques yep. I'm going to colour in with graphite pencils mm -hmm. very quickly and I, mm -hmm. that's a pleated one I did and I'll show you how yeah. I did that so I'm only going to do yep. a little bit of it okay and then so you can colour in. So I've stamped it on this on the other side, but you can yeah. colour it in. Whichever. Whichever. So with, even with a pencil, you can colour so this in. Pencil and plastic usually you, you don't, don't, you, don't yeah. mix, you don't mix, but these blend beautifully. Yeah. So you're just, just literally just colouring in. So I'm just yeah. literally just putting that on there. Because yeah. you don't want to see my colouring technique. Yeah. It's not great. But you can see how the pencil just takes to the dual art beautifully. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. And what else you can do is with watercolour pencils. Yeah. So, so let's, have a, let's have a green, yeah. let's have a, have a green yeah. feather. So this is watercolour pa um, yeah. pencil. So I'm just going to colour it in. Yeah. Roughly. And again. <clears throat> okay, like that. Yeah. Oh, so do yeah. A bit darker. On and so you can even blend different colours in yeah. there with it. So this is this is watercolour. And then yeah. what I'm going to do, I'm going to get a paintbrush oh. with a tad of water. water. Yeah. yeah. And then you can just move the, move the colour around. So yeah. just, you just, can you see how it blends? Yeah, it does. I can see it, yeah. Yeah. Oh. That's, and this, this is, you couldn't do this on acetate or anything like that. Yeah. But you can on Jurala. Okay. I, and of course, you've got you have the material there, and you can also get get the colour that comes through on that side. Of course, because it has got that answer. And you can have something on the back yeah. of it. So if you've got a colourful paper on the back of it, yeah. so where well, you can see it's my hand, you, yeah. you, just, you just get a depth of colour, yeah. and you can do the, exactly the same techniques on the yeah. white. So on the on, on the, the craft yeah, plastic, yeah, yeah, on the craft plastic does as well. Does the uh, Duralar also, if when you apply heat, how does it react? It, it, 
you can the heat emboss on it. Yeah. If you don't, if you do it quite quick, the yeah. quick in the heat emboss, you can heat, you can use the heat emboss which mm -hmm. you showed earlier. Um, but you can also bend it. Okay. So when it's still wet, um, warm, you can manipulate it, yeah. and it, and when it's cool, it'll hold its shape. Okay. So yeah. which is perfect if you're doing um, for yeah. flowers. Okay. So you want a bit of dimension on your cards, yeah. you can do that. So that is your. So that's coloured in yeah. very roughly. Mm -hmm. Okay, with the uh, with a, yeah. a graphic pencil, and then we we'll just do. Yeah. Our uh, yeah. same technique I've just just done, but I'm doing it on the um, white opaque craft plastic. Yeah, and you can see how well it blends. So I do like watercolor pencils because yeah. you can just sort of scribble it in and then just yeah, but absolutely. Water, and it looks yeah, like you've been working it. for ages. Absolutely. So a little, bit, a little bit shading on there, yeah. and, and then it looks lovely. So with a damp brush, yeah, and just move it around. And w will not be come off after it dries. No, it should, it should it will stay put when oh. it's dry. Yeah, no, it, it won't flake off. It will uh -huh. stay put. Yeah. It's because it's a non porous surface. It will yeah. take a little while to dry. Yeah, cause, of course. Because you yeah. have to wait basically for the um, water yeah. to evaporate. You can use uh, alcohol uh, alcohol inks on this. Not beautiful yeah. acrylic inks, watercolor yeah. paints. You oh, can use on yeah. it. You can oil pastels. Yeah. In fact, there's not much you can't put on here. To be honest, oh, uh, yeah. the only thing you can't put on here, I found it was distress oxide. Uh, distress inks. Ah, uh, okay. But distress oxides work yeah, well with it. Uh, yeah, because they are the pigment in yeah, there. Yeah, so the pigment does yeah. it. So that's basically how you can do that, and then you can color in with a bit more time, wow. and you get. Yeah. Put on you a bit clean. Yeah, 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 that's better. Yeah. yeah. So like that. Yeah. That okay. is lovely. Yeah, All you can right. see. So it. that's you just a very yeah. quick. Yeah, yeah. I'm just going to keep with it that. there and look at that. You can see how. Uh, then we're going to have a close up, and you can see okay. how well. I mean, I love that. I love and, that. And that's, and that's, that's my not yeah. very good coloring in, but however. No, you, no, no. And this is remember. You can see, it's, it's, it's a, a mirror image. It's a, it's a mirror image. And it's easy to do, and it's. It's an it's artificial surface, and you're using pencils on it. Yeah, which is phenomenal, which is, very, yeah, which which is, is very, very rare. Yeah. If you want to grab yours, of course, include, including the Dural Art and the Craft Plastic, your details are on the screen. Exactly what you're getting is that what you see in the in the image there. So you get the Dural Art and the Craft Plastic. Now, of course, you have got, uh, you know, you are getting, how many sheets do you get of each? Sorry, kind of 25 of the Dural Art and 25 uh, the other ones of the plastic. So 50 sheets in total, and trust me, they are something that are incredible to work with. Now, of course, the very busy. We are very busy for the starter kit because oh, actually, we are not very busy. We are extremely busy now. We did sell out of that one, and of course, we did ask Maggie of uh, if we could get some more, and we are back. We have got some back on extended delivery. Uh, it will be dispatched from the 31st of January. I don't January of March. <laughs> uh, 14 pounds. And 99 pence is your prices. Now, if you wanted a precision toolkit, we have got that one also. I think we have been very busy as well for that one. Over half of the stock has already gone. Hinge spaces, the corner cover tool, as well as the alignment guide that you are getting. Also, that ring binder that you can keep them all together, except of course that spacer. Uh, now, of course, a four, 24 pounds and 99 pence plus PMP if you're not a Freedom member will get you everything. And then, of course, we have got the craft tools. Now the uh, multi-purpose uh, Teflon tool, I am a massive fan of this one because it works so many different ways. It, it, you, everything that the bone folder can do, this can do 10 times better basically. It, it also, but also is, I use it for the spatula and different mm -hmm. things like that. 15 pounds and 99 pence and worth every penny. Now we have got also the album kit. Um, it's the 8 by 8 option here. You have got the gray board as well. Uh, of course, uh, the precision cut, the pre-score pages, the black card, the covers and the spine. Of course, not forgetting the archetype as well as the magnets. 815464 is your item number with a freedom price of 25 pounds and 19 pence. And what are we doing now? Right, okay. What I'm going to do is just going to show you because we're talking about this concept with um, new pre cut and scored pages. Yeah. Okay. Now, traditionally, when yeah. you do an album pocket page, you have to cut two pieces. Yes. So you've got one piece cut yeah. here, you've got one piece yeah. here, and it scores on both yeah. sides. And that would require two A4s. So it would yeah, be. okay. And then you have to stick and line up yeah. one on there mm -hmm. and one on there like yeah. that, which will then create. Pocket. Your pocket yeah. page like that. Yeah. Okay. Don't need to do that anymore. Okay. Okay. So here's your piece of pre-cut card. Yeah. Okay. It's already pre-scored okay. for you in one place. I'm just going to get my scoreboard. Yeah. And scoreboard. Okay. Yeah. So this is for your 
eight by eight yep, album. Eight by eight okay. Album. So you're going to measure. So yeah. your score line is at eight inches there. Okay, yeah. okay that's a pre-score. Let me see it. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Is perfect. Right. Yeah. And you can see it's shiny because that's mm -hmm. not been scored with a Teflon one. Right. I'll just turn that round there, and that's seven and a half. But it's the eight inches yeah. that you want. Okay. And then you're going to score in half mm -hmm. an inch. Yeah. This side. Okay. okay. Yeah. Put that out of the way. If they don't have a, um, a scoring tool, they can you measure it up. Yeah, they yeah, you can measure it up with a with a Would ruler. you recommend to make a mark both top and bottom? Yes. So it's fine. Yeah, straight. it's yeah. easier. So that's my half inch there. Let me just fold this one here. Okay. Oh, I see. So it's so clear. that's that. So then you just put you can put your double sided tape. Yeah, we do actually have an adhesive we set. We do that's have got, got an um, adhesive set. Which, it's got our special. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we've got. Out if I can. Um, it's got uh, a double-sided, strong adhesive. I've we'll just thrown it on the floor. <laughs> uh, there it is. Well, we can have got this. Oh, yeah. yeah. So we have but one the, there. But the um, tape is um, specially cut for us. Yeah. By Pink Frog. It's yeah. Three eighths of an inch wide. Oh. And the reason we have it three eighths of an inch wide is because with your score flaps for fixing yeah. your pockets and things, that's half an inch, and yeah. you don't want the adhesive to go right to okay. the edge. Yeah. Okay. So that's like that. Mm -hmm. And you're just going to pop that on there. And you also get the double-sided adhesive yeah. sheets, which we and can that is super strong. And that is perfectly matched. Yeah. And we actually used this format when we did a workshop, yeah, and okay. it was so quick. But yeah. also, you get a perfect page okay. instead of having little overlaps there. So that's your pocket page done. All right. Okay. So. Amazing. Page starter kit. Now, when you get yeah. your page starter kit, oh, yeah, we you'll get a set of four dies, mm -hmm. which we call never ending strip mm -hmm. dies. They all have a cutting line mm -hmm. along yeah. here. They have a debossed line, yeah. and then they might have either little little tiny dots yeah. or dashes. And they okay. do have got also uh, notches to do the They've center. They've got alignment notches here. Yeah. Yep. Can you see? It's probably easier to show you on there. Yeah. That's your alignment notches just there. If you can hold yeah there. Yeah, you I can see. move my finger and then you can see it. There, 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 yeah, there, there, there they there are. Yeah, yeah, just cool. there. Okay. So you know there's where yeah. the center is. Okay. So this is my first one. I've already cut yeah. one. And by okay. the way, that is the star ticket at the or the album. The page album star page. Yeah, that yeah. did sell out early and it's now back on extended dispatch from the thirty first of March. Uh, a quarter of the stock has already gone. So okay. please do check so out the baskets. That's probably. one cut, but you can see yeah but my die is only yeah. that long. Okay, so I'm just yeah. going to show you how so to do it. So they are six it. inches long? They're six inches long, but they have no cutting end. Yeah. So okay. then you can extend it, never yes. ending. Yeah, that's why they're called never yeah. ending. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I've put a little note to yeah. myself here. Make yeah. sure the cutting edge okay. is on the edge. Yeah. Okay, so here's my die. Yeah. That's my cutting line there. Yeah. And I'm just going to pop it yeah. on here yeah. and stick it down. And there are different shapes. We've got um, like there's wavy shapes, there's curved shapes, but it's just really so you can add a bit of interest to pages. But these yeah. aren't just for album making. A lot of the girls have used them for making fancy cards, yeah, fancy, I, fancy well, mats. I, I have to say, like, um, I, I, you're probably gonna. Um, um, shout at me in one of the But when I do a mini albums, I'm not as precise as you are. Yeah. I'm not. I'm a little bit messier. And with my, uh, of course, they they don't look as robust as yours. But I can see myself using every single item that you bring us because yeah. you can be as you want to be. You don't have to be uh, that precision yeah. thing. But if you want to take to the next level, if you want your yeah. books to be, you need a cool cat's craft uh, tools. I remember when um, Leon was prepping for one of the shows. It was one of the first, um, you know, first times that she she yes. used them and let Leone loose. Talking about two years ago, maybe something like uh, that. A year? I think about a year. A year ago. So yeah. yeah. It was it was amazing because she was like, everything that Maggie does is so proper. It's not just she just doesn't give you tools that just work. No, no they've got to work. Really well. Having said that, this hasn't worked, but it made a big clunk, didn't it, when yeah. it went through? So well, I'm the reason is because probably you, you put it across that. Um, yeah, I had it lined yeah. up wrong, didn't I? So I'm going to do it again because they do cut absolutely uh, Well, you would show the never-ending uh, ability of it. Yeah. yeah, okay, right. So let's start again, and I'll try and do it without a clunk. Okay, let's pop it yeah. through. So, yeah. 
Well, sometimes they have, like, is it, this is one of the machines here, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Yeah. So it's sometimes right. like kind Okay, of so let's start again. Yeah. Oh, that sounds better already. Yeah. If you put it sideways, I maybe don't know why it's not. It worked beautifully yeah. Um, yeah. yesterday. No, no, it's no. It's, it should be if you put it like this. Let's then try. It's just like, the problem is that everybody uses it in that's a different. That's it. Yeah. There. Okay. Is so that let's because what, they are two rollers, and when you put the something yeah. parallel to them, that's better. Yeah. But now, yeah. <laughs> I've put my cutting edge the wrong way. But, but look at this beautiful. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> This is hilarious. Um, so you know, we will right. fix it. We're we'll okay. fixing the heavy. Right. Go so, but open. these little holes yeah. pop out, so you've got a really nice strip. Yeah. So now I'm going to do it properly. Okay. Okay. So okay. I, will... you know, Maggie wanted just to show you the different ways on how not to do it. <laughs> yes. And then teach you the, exactly the right <laughs> I'm way. I'm sorry, to these do it. actually work beautifully, but they I'm do. really, they I'm do. really showing them off really badly. You know what? Um, I remember. I will always remember. I did one show with the stamp pla stamping platform. I had done so many, and it was just like mm, one of the tools that I still use to this day. Is one yeah. of those ones. And just the first time, I just went wrong. Why? Because the stamp was a sticky. Pull the paper, move it a little bit, and the whole point of the work. Just the first yeah, demo. Just yeah. one of those things. It's this. Sorry, Charlotte. This was going to be a yeah. quick demo. But however, <laughs> people know that it is. But you need to see. Products because yeah. half the stock has already okay. gone of that. Never of the center delivery. Of course, it's right. fresh from the thirty-first of March. So let's try again. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I've put a new piece yeah. of card in. Okay. I've got my cutting line in yeah. the right place. Yeah. And we'll run it through. Okay. All right. Okay, fingers crossed. Fingers crossed that this time. Right. And then, and there we are. Uh, oh, it has to lucky. Yeah. Okay, right. Perfect. So, I just. I love also the, the little uh, kind of film strip sort of element to yes. it. Yes. Because yeah. then it means that you can. Okay, so you can see all the little holes yeah. there, but you just run your scissors along. Yeah. And they'll all pop out. Or if like you have that, that, or one of the rollers. You know yeah. what else works so sometimes really well? A, you know, a lint um, roller. Oh, a sticky roller. Yeah. So from the back. It's sometimes so it kind of really I'm just going to move this out of the way for a second because I just want to show you how to line it up. Mm, yeah. Okay. Okay. So. Okay. Now these will, will bend mm -hmm. a little bit, but they're workhorses. Yeah. They're designed. They're designed to do that. Mm. Okay. So take your die. Now you can see this bit. Yeah. That's already cut. Okay. Yeah. And then what you're going to do is make sure you've got your cutting okay. side yeah. on the right side. Yeah. And what you're going to do is you're going to line it yeah. up. And, and it has a clink. And it, it, it locks yeah, into it locks place. In but you need to take this down. Yeah. Well. Yeah. And then. So again, you're going to just lock it into place. Yeah. Okay. That's it. And then just put it there. Okay. And then, so, and then we'll. Okay. And then of course we'll let the machine like a machine. We'll run it back through. There you go. Okay. All right. So you put it through. 60% of the stock of the star ticket has already gone. Fourteen pounds and ninety-nine pence. Okay. Remember, you are getting those four never-ending uh, dies, as well as the neo neodymium. Neo neo neodymium. Neo That's it. Perfect. Neo uh, I mean, you know, when I, I want to say it right, I mean, not that I will ever architect, uh, architect as well, and of course that a uh, Mac pop die. Did I say yes, correctly? You, said, yeah. you said it perfectly. Yes. I mean, it's only taken me like five times to, to get it right. It's <laughs> absolutely fine. So I'm just going to trim this because obviously okay. I had to yep. cut a new piece of Remember, paper. Remember, half of the stock has already got... No, sorry, 60. Wait, what's wrong with me? I was just like, I just said it and just kind of... Uh, no. so just cut that one there. Sometimes my memory... And we'll cut that one there. Sometimes it was very good this morning and then suddenly it's gone. That's because you're tired. Yeah. The little cat. Well, not little. It's, yeah. <laughs> your favourite cat. Yeah. My old cat, yeah. Your old cat. So take the tape off because otherwise your little, um, yeah. the holes won't pop out. Okay, yeah. Okay. And then you just run it along. Yeah. 
and you can see how easily yeah, they pop out. They yeah. just pop out. I know I've got some more tape yeah. a bit further along here. So we'll just yeah. poke those out. Just keep yeah. going along. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we're nearly done. Yeah. Last one's there. Yeah. Because there's tape behind there. You can yeah. see that. That's why it's not popping out. Over 70% of okay. the stock now. Now I will remember, 7-0, that's over 70, and then the next time they will say 80, and then I will be like, oh, it's 7, oh no. Uh, and do it perfectly, seven. don't do it like I've done it today. <laughs> no, so. but it, you know what, but I you think... Need to, you, yeah. need to, you need to just play with them. Yeah. Okay, so let's get rid of this, these bits and pieces here. Yeah. So here's a page, Yeah. I've already stuck the flap in. Yeah. Now I have my Magpop stuck already okay, yeah. on this side. Yeah. So. This is my architect. Yep. I've already pre-cut it, and you can see the little tiny, yeah, the little um, deboss mm -hmm. bit in it. So we'll peel this off. Okay. And and of course, it creates that recess, yeah. perfect recess. Find perfect. where your magnet is. Yep. Just pop that over the top. Yeah. And then just let your magnet drop down. There. A little bit more. It's alright. It's just because I'm yeah. a bit OCD. Okay. And just fold that over. Yeah. And that's such a cool tip. I remember when I yeah. started working with magnets, I always used to get them the wrong place. Yeah. But that placing okay. with that... Burnish that really well. And that shows how the Magpop die is so important yeah. because sometimes you put a piece, bigger piece of paper and it just doesn't quite work. Yes, okay. And then we're going to stick. Hmm. So I've, ink, I've cut my paper already yeah. and I've inked around the edges. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm just going to pop that on there. And I love that because it's never ending. So would it does that? You can make it as long as you yeah. like. Yeah. So if you like a smaller card, say yeah. six by four or something yeah. like that, would work perfectly. If you like five by fives, they will work fine. Yeah. You and nine by seven, yeah, that would be absolutely and fine. If you want to do a really quick album, yeah. do one with them um, six by six pages, and then you can just cut straight yeah. across. You don't have now, to. Now I have got some news though. A starter kit. Technically sell out. Oh, I thought gosh. that we would give you 80%, but uh, they, but you know what? It did sell out. Uh, that was the you know it did sell out early, and it, what we were brought it back, but that has sold out as well. So th uh, thank you for everybody who purchased. You are gonna have so much fun. Uh, now uh, we have had an email from oh Karen from Pink Frog. Oh, morning Karen. Good morning Karen. How are you? It was lovely to see you yesterday. Loving the show. I'm so glad. It's not only me that has got on air disasters and <laughs> laughing out loud. <laughs> you know what, Karen? You, me, Maggie, everybody, yeah. Leone has them. We are all in that, yeah, live TV. Uh, I just love all your memory book dies, and I can totally confirm how precise they have to be for Maggie. They cut beautifully, and they make mem your memory book so professional. Keep up with the new ideas to make our lives simple. Oh, love thank Karen. you, Karen. That's lovely. And we have got another, another email from Alison Fletcher, and say, morning. Morning, Alison. Morning, Alison. Ladies, you have done it again. The drop side album is amazing. Just love the Teflon tool. If you don't have one I, and have <laughs> ordered any color cards, uh, this is a must. Seriously, every crafter needs one. You know what? Not only one, sometimes they need two. Yes. <laughs> the same. Uh, even work, I do, you have got two. I'm very lucky. Uh, even works on bur burnt pants. Yeah, it's good for cleaning ovens, but don't oh. use yours, use yeah. your friends. <laughs> <laughs> the burn pan or the Teflon? The Teflon too, I use K's, yeah. Uh, as, as Maggie. Yeah. Oh, Chanda, pure joy during these dismal times. Keep up the good work. You know what, Alison, I couldn't agree Thank more. Thank you, Alison, We That's hope lovely. to bring you a little bit of brightness and a little bit of sunshine and cr lots of crafting um, for yeah, everybody out definitely. there. Definitely. And the ones who are here as well. Okay, so I've just cut another decorative strip along here, but I'm mindful of the time, so um, I'm not going to poke all the bits yep. out, but that would go on there like that, okay? Uh, yep, and that will be another tuck in pocket. <gasps> because, of course, these never ending dice can be pockets yes. as well. Yep. But what you can do is, if you don't like the black behind mm -hmm. there, cut a contrasting strip, uh, put it behind, and then when you stick it onto your page, you will mm -hmm. have That's amazing. a lighter. Yep. Lighter contrast you are underneath. So okay. to yeah, except my fish are upside down, but we won't worry about that. 
you know, fish. So I've done really well with this demo. They like so to see the world's upside down. Let's see what you down. do with it, because I'm sure you'll do a much better job of than I do. Of course, they want do. to see what's above the sky. Yeah, of course. You know, yeah. it's very important. They need to see if there is something. Of course, <laughs> if you want to go for the preschool album packet pages, because that's what you're using to, you know, the substrate. Yes, basically. it is. Yeah. Um, I mean, joking aside, we have actually done it, so it's really, really easy for you to use, yeah. for you to start out. It's really important. Yeah, it is, of course. Th th you have got a freedom price, £25.19, where you are getting, of course, the preschool uh, pages, the black heart, and the covers, the spines, the archetype, as well as the neodymium. neodymium. Yes, I got it. Yeah, I mean, where is the round of applause? <laughs> uh, thank you. I eight one five four six four is your item number. Twenty seven pounds and ninety nine pence. If you are not a freedom member, we have got also the drop side box. Of course, we have got uh, there. We have got the cream side. Of course, the option first is six eight one nine zero six. Of course, you have got them uh, as well. It comes with the magnets as well as the uh, archetype as well. Of course, that's the instructions. But more importantly, you have got that precision card gray board which means that everything has been done for you so you don't have to measure anything or cut anything 681906 is your item number now if you want to go for the black that is the one that Maggie was using that is the one that had been pre-scored for you as well so it's a perfect starter kit if you wanted to go for no sorry this one not she was using the eight, Maggie was using the a by eight but this is another one pre-scored with the black album pages in there 27 pounds and 99 pence with all the uh, precision cut uh, gray board. Then we have got also the, uh, the journal kit which is MDF so the, bay, the covers are and then also you are getting mix two so it makes the 19 and a half by 16 uh, and a half MDF uh, so you get in two different sizes, yeah. Those are the different size, the heights of it. Uh, of course, you you have getting of course the MDF um, spine and uh, sides and front and, and back, but also the elastic, so you can put the papers. And the papers have been already; they are there for to just fold them and then you can put them inside. Now, 19 pounds and 99 pence for both of those. Then we have got the toolkit next. We can, of course these ones are the ones that have got the hinge spacers, the corner cover, the tool, and the alignment guide. They are essential if you want precision and you want the perfect spacing every single time then of course if you want precision and you want something that stays put of course you want adhesives a strong adhesives includes this one includes the double-sided adhesive the artist stack and the red liner tape remember the red liner tape is a uh, three uh, Three eighths of an inch, and of course has been cut precision to work with the uh, flaps and the score lines that uh, Maggie uses. So you won't have to trim anything down. Right. So we are back to uh, Maggie. Okay. okay. I was saying, hey, I'm like, oh, right. what's wrong with me? Today? I think there is something going on because Maggie did the mistakes, which she never does. Then I kind of put a word right. So you know, it's Don't everything. Don't worry about it. I'm going to mess up this one now. Yep. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Well, so, yeah. I've cut out three two, or three. <laughs> yeah. so I've cut out two more um, uh, from the sh sh uh, pieces that I can fold over and put my journal yeah. from the uh, paper white plastic yeah. and the jeweler and yeah. I'm going to put some alcohol ink on yeah. them. So I'm just going to yeah. do nothing, not, nothing very fancy. Okay. I'm just going to put some ink on a, fa a felt mm. pad. So these ones are alcohol, These right? are alcohol yeah. inks, yeah. yeah. <coughs> so you can set, so you can use so many of your mediums yeah. on these substrates. You know what I did once? It was like you use acrylic paints and use it as a monoprint sort of thing. You can do that. It's perfect. It's, it's, it's perfect. Really, really it works. The, the um, uh, um, acrylic paints yeah. work br brilliantly. Yeah. If of time, yeah. we do that. So basically, yeah. I'm just pouncing. Yeah. So it just moves around, yeah. and you can yeah. add some alcohol yeah. on there. And see what it does. Oh, look at that! And it's just, it's just it's literally, I'm just pouncing yeah. it around, and you just get the, the colour is so vibrant. Yeah, it is. And of course, you can add a little bit of water and see what I happens. I love alcohol. Uh, you can just yeah. move that around. Obviously, do this in a ventilated area. I did it once. Uh, I did it late at night yeah. at home, yeah. and I did it in an enclosed area. And I got up, and I was yeah. definitely a bit worse. Yeah. <laughs> luckily, luckily, I was at home. No, I, I, I would else. recommend with alcohol, of course, <laughs> do it in a well yeah, ventilated well area, well area. area yeah. or uh, do it, uh, you know, with. Um, and of course, you can do the same on the dual arm mat as well. Yeah. Oh. And you get a, a different effect. Of course. Yeah, that's. So you, get a, a complete, so you can just have a look, and all I've done was pounce it, yeah. and when it's dry, it's fantastic, and of course it's, it moves that. around lovely, so yeah. if I open it up, 
Yep. So another thing you can do is then, um, if you open it up, then yeah. is, whoops, yeah. like that. I'm trying to flatten it down again. Yeah. It takes a crease beautifully as well. Yeah, it and does. I, and I use obviously the bone yeah. folder for do, uh, to do that, and it takes it beautifully. So yeah. what we can do then is put little drops of it. Yeah. Awesome. I was very uh -huh. like when I was playing. I was playing that. What it was last week when I was using memory box eyes, and of course, um, memory box has got like very intricate, delicate yes. details. So it was. I was attaching it to it, and it was beautiful. It, it just moves around, and you, yeah. oh, you just. You, yeah, it is gorgeous. Yeah. In. Oh, look at that! Yeah, it just moves around. And, just and it doesn't. Point. It doesn't buckle. It doesn't. No, like, you it know. doesn't. So what I would probably do on that is put something heavy just to yeah. keep it flat. And I probably would have done this before I creased it. And then this one has got these are the particular. Ah, uh, the mixatives, yeah. Some uh, and you can get a bit. This is a lovely gold on yeah. this one, and it does lots of nice things. So that has got proper pigments in there, so therefore yeah. it has got like. So you can just it just drops in like that. Oh, I love it. And you that. just that's it. And you just yeah. and you just let it go. And yeah. on my album, I just let and it go and I just let see what see what it did. And then of course you can use a finger as well with yeah. a bit of that, and then just just move it around. So it's basically you're just messing around and playing. Yeah. Of course, if you want to be a more like you know, if, uh, just maybe use a, a glove for um, put yes. your fingers in yes, there. Yes, yeah. <laughs> just wanted to say, yeah, 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 I'm not going to hang around waiting for yeah. the gloves on. <laughs> so you can put some more of this in, and it, it, and you just wait, just wait for it to dry. It just yeah. it's beautiful. It just, it, 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 yeah, and that's just, and then you just put a background on that. Yeah, a, 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 a silhouette of a die yeah, cut or anything absolutely. else, and then you've just got a picture yeah. quite happily. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go and put some paint yeah. on as well. So I'll move okay. these to one side, yeah. and they can be doing their thing over there. Yeah, and then we'll do some paint. So okay, we've got so plenty of time. Yeah, we? there we do. We okay. have got nine minutes. Oh yeah. right, okay. We'll yeah. bag the time yet. Yeah. So. <laughs> because once you have it like this, imagine to put it into your art journal case. You but have got all this playing time. What I would do is like there are days where I find that I like to do backgrounds and I do this, this, and that. All sorts of yeah, just stack of backgrounds. Then yeah. just another day I want to construct something, so I yeah. put it into the art journal. And then another time I want to actually pretty it up all. Yeah. So then then is when I get my stamps and my yeah. dies yeah. and everything else. Oh, so, so the thing I you could get this one back in. Yeah. So what you could do on this, yeah. you could put a stencil on it. Yeah. And just lay a stencil yeah. on it. Leave it to dry yeah. and then peel your stencil off. Yeah. And it's it, you have a really fantastic effect wow, when you do that. That is that's I mean, really and that's just amazing. And the fantastic colours I've just met yeah. around. Of course I haven't what I haven't got is any of the craft plastic with me because okay. I've moved it to the top. Shall can we just grab move, can you some? Off, can I just get, get off? Yeah, I'll get oh, a, a we're, we're gonna fantastic. get some. Yeah. Okay, I'll put so it out of the way from Maggie's demonstration, okay. and I forgot to bring it back in. Thank and you very much. And that feels mo uh, thicker, doesn't it? That is, yeah, because you, you get you get proper. Is it Upo paper that you have? Yeah. Drinking alcohol. I personally prefer this because this is so much thicker. Yeah, it um, is. And also, so it feels more matte to it than yes. Upo. It does yeah. feel that. Uh, it is it's like really it. substantial. You yeah. can, it can be a card on its own because yeah. it is a, a really good one. And weight. being twelve by twelve is also brilliant because it then means that you can do a six by six. Uh, like you can do four six by six uh, panels. Yeah. So there is a long, yeah. uh, you know, a lot of a, a lot of use of it. So, so you can put uh, paint on it. You can use it as a, we can use it as a palette if you wanted to. Of course. But you can use it uh, for paint. And then paint. you could wipe it clean. Yeah. Because of the time. Yeah, it could just wa it just wash off. Yeah. So. Uh, oh, could you? Uh, kind of with heating the size to create more of a con like a pa proper palette, so it has yes, got like yes, a little. Yeah, little you could, yeah, yeah. yeah, you could do. Yes, like you could do that as well. Yeah, you could do that as well. Yeah. So I've uh, got some paintbrushes as well somewhere. I'm sitting here doing that. They're over here. Yeah. <laughs> well, what okay, I can do. So that's okay. That's what I can do is. Um, with a Kevlar tool, you could do a do a, use a spatula as well. You could you do spread it. Oh, look. I've got Maggie's. Yeah. <laughs> so, yes, yeah, so you can just spread it out. So you can get that effect. So what yeah. really, really is nice yeah. is if you just do yeah. that, yeah. and then you can go down with a different colour, yeah. and then you can use an old credit card, yeah. but that, yeah. but you can see how it takes the paint, yeah. but because it's on a, on a, um, a non-porous surface, yeah. that you would have to wait a little while to dry. It's drying quite quickly in here, but you can yeah. see how it's drying, mm -hmm. and just bring that down. And it, that is just perfect as a background on its own. Fabulous. So. So if, it, yeah. if I have a paintbrush, I could do, you do something yeah. else with it as well. well. I like that. Do, I, like, yeah. I like that as well. Yeah. And then you could just do the same with with the uh, Duralar. Duralar. Yeah. It's just so cool. It's just 
it, I it's guess, how to describe it. If you like the look, look of parchment, you can do absolutely and loads you like with the this. look of acetate, so this is just in between. It gives you has got the the so, nature of acetate. So what that you can, can do then is what you suggested: is do a bondo print. Yeah. And see what happens yeah. on here. So it's, it's basically it's just it's just a bit of playing. Yeah. And then we'll just peel that and off. That's a and, yeah. and you've got a monoprint. Love print. that. Love, love, love that. And you've got the lovely texture in there yeah. as well. So you could go yeah. on again with some more. Yeah. So and then you just add add on, keep adding on to it. Yeah. So when that's dry. That's gonna be a lot uh, of fun. Gonna, and you can do that. Yeah. And then what you can do then is get that to dry. And add yeah. on some more. Well, I'll just get yeah. some, some. I love that because the, this is a mono printing techniques, but it's kind so of going to be a very so you easy. Get that to dry. Okay. Can and you show us a little bit how it would mold? Like if you wanted to heat yeah, it. Yeah, of course up. I can. Yeah. So I'll, 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 I'll strip off and we'll yeah. heat it. Eat so some. So I kind of really think that this. Sorry, I kind of interrupted your. No, that's, that's fine. That's fine. I was only messing around anyway, yeah. so that's fine. Because <laughs> I just kind of think that while this is dry, it's not... Yeah, well, I mean, it's amazing it's that you can gently heat it up, but then... So if I've got a strip of it... Yeah. So if you, you could do a flower if you wanted to, but I'll just do a strip yeah. and just heat it. Yeah. And you'll see it, it'll start moving. Yeah. That's it, you can just see it's warm through. Mm. Because if it, what you can also do, if it, if it heats up, mm -hmm. if you, and you just heat it and just let it flatten it down, it'll go back to flat. So that's quite okay. warm now. And you should be able to just, just twist it um, and you just hold it Yeah. until it's cold. So then, so it's like a, th it's a thermal plastic. So yeah. It's so cold. basically, if you have got uh, dyes that are flowers, you yeah. die cut them. Yeah. Uh, of course, it will have to be open flowers, not very freely, because yes. plastic doesn't like freely yeah. dyes. And then you know, just kind of show it. I'll give that, give that to you. And then yeah. You can see, it, so it holds its shape. Yeah, it does. So if hold. you're doing, a, 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 yeah, a, a, a flower with some dimension, it would just hold its shape. And there it is. I'm um, then kind of fills it there. You can see. So it stays there. And it, 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 um, Can you imagine like decorations, like paint them as well? And I can afford those hands. Um, one of the things that Leone likes to do also now is to use a spool, um, you know, the old fashioned spool of uh, ribbon spools. Oh, yes. And then you can roll it up, heat yeah. it, hold it there, oh. and then you can then do it. So that would, and then it will yeah. look. And if you. Well, Maggie had a brilliant idea as well. If you, do, you could add a box, yeah. and you can have ribbons coming, curling ah, down. Yeah. You know, or and decoration you like a, a cake. You know, like a cake. You know, yeah. the, the and what have you. That would be yeah, lovely, absolutely yeah. stunning, yeah. You can do absolutely loads of things with it. Okay, I'm going to do this a bit of heating bossing okay. with it because I found what I can do with it. Yes, well, of course. <laughs> no, it is a fabulous ostrich. Yeah. And do, uh, please uh, do check out your baskets if you want any item from uh, Cool Cats Crafts. So I would suggest you use an um, anti static yeah. bag on it. Definitely. And I'm going to use stays on because yeah. I'm going to be really quick with it. Yeah. I, I, I la I see, I am a big fan of the stays on. I know some people don't like it, but I, I really like it because uh, you, uh, uh, you can you can heat and boss with it on a, a porous surface, but you've got to be extremely quick. Exactly. But the, on, because it's a non-porous surface, yeah. you've got you got a couple of a few, yeah. a few seconds to do. Yeah. So I'm going to just ink, ink, ink up the stamp. Yeah. We have got three minutes or so. Three okay, minutes. that's fine. And I press that in. Yeah. But you can see how well it takes yeah. an image yeah. as well. You stamp with it, it stamps beautifully. Okay. And then I'll just put some embossing yeah. powder on. Okay. And that's it. Okay. And then I'll just, okay. just flick off the excess. And then yeah. what, I would, what I would do if I had more time is brush yeah. that off. But then okay. we can just do. This is so thick, I thought okay. I've got two sheets yeah. here, but I've only got one. So what I tend to do is make sure that your heat tool is heat, is okay, hot. Yeah. So just give it a couple of seconds. And then you don't want to yeah. move this round. So you can just see, yeah. as soon as it goes, just move it. There we go. Can you see it's going? Yeah. Okay. And you can see that it's, it's slightly buckling under the heat, but it will come yeah. back down again. Oh, yeah. Yeah, see. Oh, look at that. It's looking like it's... it's Okay. Yeah, that and just is hold that it. in place. Just leave it, leave it there. And, and let it go. Catch it. Yeah. And then when it's, it's cold enough, you can go, you can go down. Oh wow! You can heat, put, put it down. So yeah. that's. Yeah, if is. you leave it, it's and I can hold it like that. Yeah. So or you can show it to uh, the overhead. Oh right. Let, let's, let's put it. <laughs> yeah, no, don't worry. You couldn't hear it. I could hear them and try. Oh there you right. Can okay. See all everything. A, and, and, and obviously it heats the bosses as well. Wow. So it's so absolutely fantastic. And you can see how this is drying now. Yeah. 
So you can, so it's not quite dry yet. So mm. some of it's dry, but it doesn't take long. It's, and, and, and the alcohol inks off. are completely dry. Some of them, some so of them. So that, that's drying out nicely. Look at that! How so gorgeous do, it is! Look color. at that! You've got little flecks yeah. of color of uh, gold in there yeah. as well. This one's taking a little bit longer. Wow! But again, you can move it around quite yeah. happily. No good. Yeah, if you if you hold it there, yeah, there. That's it. There. Yeah, that's perfect. There. So you see how it's going yeah, down. Yeah, I love that. that. So you can make a droopage, droopage, drop or, or whatever you want. Yeah. Oh. Okay, and of course, if, if you don't really like it, you can take some of it out. Yeah. So you can just so oh, yeah. it will stay that it will stay that underneath. But if you don't want to all that colour, yeah. you can take that out and oh. move that around. You can put some more that yeah. on it, and you, 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 yeah. until you're happy with it, really. Yeah, so thank you, just you keep, very just keep much. Playing. Okay. So it's it's a, it's a material that all the stuff that you've got will you go yeah. on it. And basically. it's going to be hours of fun just it's throwing right. everything what you have got in there. Now, when are you back? Uh, we're back sometime in April. All oh, right, so we will. I can't remember. I can't remember. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> well, it, thank you so much. Uh, of course, we are going to say bye to Maggie, who is waiting uh, for a year. Bye, Maggie. Bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs> And of course, we are, you know, we keep Kaya here for a few more minutes. And just to tell you that, thank you so much for, uh, you know, for being here. Pleasure. Thank you, thank you Maggie, everybody. as well. And of course, do check out your baskets. Uh, after the break, we will be having another inspirational hour. Uh, of course, do keep watching Hot Anda. And thank you very much. We hope to be able to bring you a little bit of delight and crafty uh, inspiration here every day. Bye. Bye. Knitting with sardines for tea are fabulous, fabulous, fabulous. I have seen a cat with a red cape. I am in love. Clever Prince one day special after that, and then Pentel with Leone Pujol. Would you like to improve your crafting techniques? by watching and crafting along with your favourite Hachanda guest demonstrators or from the comfort of your own home? If the answer is yes, then we are excited to invite you to Craft Along, where you, our presenters and guests, will create an amazing array of projects throughout the year. Each month we will be bringing you a brand new kit that you can purchase on the day of each show. Or, if you pre-order your kit, you'll receive £5 off a purchase of £20 or more of any additional products featured within our Craft Along brand shop that month. So tune in, be inspired and create with Craft Along, your monthly crafting workshop. Hi, I'm Rob from Add Some Sparkle. My wife Jackie and I have been running Add Some Sparkle since 2010 as a small family business. We're both very passionate about paper craft in general, and Jackie's particularly passionate with paper embroidery, which is one of the main things we focus on now. So make sure you don't miss our Add Some Sparkle shows on Hochanda. Hi, my name is Maggie and I'm from Impressions Crafts. Um, I've been running my business now for 15 years. It's a small family-run business in the south of Cheshire. We have a large craft shop. We sell all sorts of beading and jewellery supplies. Um, I have a passion for making jewellery. I love working with um, the Lucite style flower beads and we make thousands and thousands of angels and have been doing so for the last few years. We've been bringing uh, to Hachanda lots of lovely beading kits, jewellery uh, for necklaces and bracelets and earrings and we also bring a wide range of angels and accessories, beading accessories like bookmarks and we also have our range of laser cut, uh, sun catchers and mobiles, all the lovely crafty beads. Hope you can tune into my shows and looking forward to seeing you on Hachanda. Well, hello everybody. Good morning. We have such a lovely show in store for you. Can I introduce you to the lovely Claire? Hello, hello. Claire. Hi. Sardines for tea. That's me. That's, that's, oh, that's yes. me. I was chatting to Claire. <laughs> I know you've said this on previous shows. This is your third live show on Hochenda. It is, yeah. 
and the business with your mum. So we've got to give Sue a mention. Yes. Sue in the green room? No, but no, my sister not. is. Oh, your si it was your sister. Yes, well, yes she's not my mum. What's your, I didn't see. <laughs> I heard you talking to someone. I didn't see who you were talking to, just in case your sister's watching. You think, what? Uh, what's your sister's name? Catherine. Catherine. Well, Welcome Catherine, I know you're watching, so hello. Um, now, tell us a little bit about the company. So <laughs> we're a very young company, two years old. Yeah. Um, and we're called Sardines for Tea because uh, yeah. it's a line from my favourite book when I was growing mm. up. So mm. it's from The Lion, the Witch yeah. and the Wardrobe. Lovely. And it's just part of the story as when one of the characters goes through the wardrobe, yeah. she's offered sardines it's for tea. tea. Mm. Well, there you go. So it's a nice way. And it's a really memorable name. Yes. And you bring us such memorable kits. Well, thank we you. We were saying the family-run business. So yourself and your mum. Yeah. And you guys do everything. We do. But you add so much personality in all the kits, and I think that is the difference because it means so much to you. You've poured all that passion, or both of you, you've poured all that passion into the kits. I think so. Yeah. But I think when, when people open our kits, they can see that somebody's cared about mm -hmm. how it's put together. I hope they do, because that's, yeah. that's what I want to get It across. comes across, and I'll give yeah. you an example, because look at just the packaging. I mean, incredibly giftable. So if you go for one of the options, uh, that's a packaging. It says Archie the dog, who we're going to be seeing in just a moment. So they all arrive beautifully packaged. Should we start with Archie the dog? Because uh, anyone wondering, uh, and we have been seeing that a lot of people have been buying even before the show went live. Tell me a little bit about Archie, because we love Archie. So I've had a new design, mm -hmm. um, and he's knitted using a really soft baby yarn. Mm -hmm. um, so it's really a really tactile yeah. uh, teddy one, so it's completed, but it's a lovely yarn to knit. Oh, he's, he is incredibly soft. Uh, he's now great company. Oh, sorry, I'm just going to have to pick him up, because I couldn't hear. What was that, Archie? Now, Archie, he wants to know, if you, if you do take him home, he does like to go out for a little walk. It doesn't <laughs> have to be far. He can just be around the house, maybe sit and watch tea with you, uh, watch dinner while you're having your tea. Mm. No vet spills. No vet spills at all. No. There we go. Uh, he t when you get into the room, his ears do go up. He likes to listen. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, there's Archie. You're absolutely right, though. He feels so soft. Yeah, he is. And you're getting everything you need uh, for our wonderful Archie the dog in the kits. The only thing you need to supply, you just need knitting needles. Everything else is stuffing. I know that you're really... Um, Keen on the quality of the components too. Yes, so uh, we use high quality yarns, yeah. um, and where it's cotton, so the little balls there, yeah. those are 100% cotton. Yeah, that's really go. important to us. Yes. And if anyone's wondering the size uh, needles that we need to any any particular size, or we're saying the instructions. Yes, it says in the instructions, but mm. each uh, toy is different. different yeah, because they're okay. different yarns. So you will get that in the instructions. There's Archie, 19.95 your price. Brand new today, 703 470, your item number. Uh, now we've got another character who you're going to fall in love with. This is Margot. Hello, Margot. Oh, Margot. So tell us a little bit. What, who inspired Margot? She reminds me a little bit of Top Cat. Yeah. So to the, I'm showing my age now, really, yeah. aren't well, I? No, we're the same age. I get Top Cat. <laughs> I remember Top Cat. Yeah, yeah so um, it's the, the face more yeah. than the body, possibly. Yeah. Yes. But, okay, one thing I want to point out with the characters that we will have, and this is brand new, I haven't brought this before, we've got uh, additional kits to allow you to create clothing for your characters as well. So with this, with this top, will we get this top in yes. the kit? Yes. Oh, this is the top we get in yeah, the kit. Yeah, you do. So having a look, 20% of the stock from Margot is gone. <laughs> it's going to be busy. I'm just going to give you a little uh, story because I was chatting to Claire just before the show, and I know last time you were here, you were starting to demo, and every time you started to demo something, you were told, no, no, it's sold out, go on to the next thing. Yes. So Claire said to me, right, when we come in, we've upped all the stock levels to ensure that we should get through the demo, and 20%'s already gone, so I can't... Uh, okay, okay. 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 Uh, we're going to move on. We've got another character, <laughs> Arthur the Rabbit. So I love the attention to detail from the... I mean, look how adorable is the clothing, the scarf you've got, a bunny, for 19.95, and such a, such a nice face. Yeah, uh, and really one of our best sellers around this time of year as of well for Easter. But yeah. because we can change the clothing, you can literally, they can, as characters, go through all the seasons. So yeah. you can make Arthur maybe a, a summer shirt if you wanted, or summer clothing, the yeah. winter clothing, uh, Halloween. Brilliant. 1995 your price for Arthur. 733-769, your item number. Just to remind you, I picked this up. Uh, we're going to have a look at Reggie. This is obviously Archie, but I just want to show all the kits. They come uh, beautifully packaged, so this is how they're going to be arriving. And if you do have a look at Reggie, if I pop this down, Reggie the Fox, look at everything that you're getting here. Beautiful quality, and that is the real key. Oh, thank you, Ben. 
So there is Reggie the Fox. So that's uh, the bag for Reggie the Fox. Just have a look at that. There we go. Ba -bum. Thank you. Let me pop that down. Tell me a little bit about Reggie there. So he's our new fox. Mm -hmm. um, I think last time we brought the small fox, which I've brought with us just so we can see it for size comparison. Okay, I'll pick him up. So I've sort of upped he's a, everything. Whoa. So it's just a, a larger version. He's a of big him. boy. So look, he there's is. Uh, the smaller version. And then there's, there's, it's like his older brother. Yeah. Okay. We like Reggie. He's a, he's a character. If you just go through the kit as well, I mean, we are getting an awful lot here for twenty two ninety five. And you said the quality of yarn, you really do use a very good quality Thank yarn. Thank you. Well, it's an Aran yarn, so mm -hmm. it's a really lovely um, yarn to work with because you, your stitches are really clear. Yeah. So if you're new to knitting, you know, there's no um, doubt where, which yeah. stitch you're on. They have yeah. a wool, uh, wool blend in them as yes, well? Yes, it's 20% wool. Yeah, love that. You're also getting your pattern uh, as well, of course. You're getting your stuffing, which is just behind here, so you can see we are getting our stuffing. Uh, we are busy. We have queues on our phone lines. Tw how 10%? 10% of the stock's already gone of our fox. And I do want to give uh, a special mention to our call center staff who do a great job. I know I mentioned the previous hour, but they are the unsung heroes of Ho Chanda. They're in the building with us, and uh, they work extremely hard. So do say hello to them from us if you are giving us a call. Okay, now we've got something. This is new, Claire. It's new, brand new. Tell yes. us a little bit of this, the so, jumper and waistcoat. Yes, we've just started doing these mini clothing mm -hmm. kits. Um, so again, it's the 100% uh, yeah. cotton Rico Roma that we're using, right. and it's uh, a smaller bag. Yeah. Um, and it's just going to show how cute is this? Uh, there is a freedom price as well, 10.34. I need to ask you a question, Claire. Are you? Are you? Do you follow? Are you aware of? Because I'm friends with an influencer who actually would wear something just like this. <laughs> um, do you know Jermaine Swede? No. You don't Should know Jermaine Swede. Introduce me, please. I will introduce you to James Sweet, uh, James, uh, James Sweet, because um, you're Jermaine, sorry, not James, Jermaine Sweet after the show. But this is the kind of thing that he would wear. Very fashionable guy. I love these. Because the whole point now is that you're going to bring us out additional clothing. I know you've got new characters on the way. Yes. We get to change their clothing. Yes. This is fantastic. We do. Take advantage of the freedom price as well. So wh which characters would this fit? So this is for the fox, for okay. Reggie. There yes. we go. That's just for uh, Reggie. Uh, but more characters in the future, potentially? Uh, that's with the next one. Okay. I'm getting yes. ahead. <laughs> my, my bad. Uh, let's move on, then, because... I know. Uh, I know. Oh. I'm so good to you. So I'll tell you, we have got uh, Kim, our producer, and she's got a lovely little boy, Abel. But when she came here and saw all of this, you're making a booty. Oh. She's, thinking, <laughs> she wants to, she's thinking about knitting this for uh, somebody else. Thank you, Ben. So here we go. There is uh, the bag uh, that he comes in. Now tell us a little bit about this character, because he is yeah. a character, George. He is, and um, he only went live in our Etsy shop yesterday. So it's Super, super new. Oh, what we're talking, world exclusive? Oh, yes. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> oh, Chanda, we love a world exclusive. Uh -huh. So here, uh, you could be the first to be giving a new home to the fantastic George Bear with his knitwear. Oh, I love that. That is a very nice jump. The jumper itself, <laughs> you should start designing your own knitwear. I tell Do you, you think? Yeah, I think yeah. so. That's fantastic. <laughs> so have a look at this, everything that you're getting. The fabric to make mm -hmm. your bear is incredible. I would say, I've been out, you, you know bears can be very expensive, so handmade bears. Something like this, if you went to a shop and if you put, say, just a little tag, certain tags on there, you'd pay an absolute fortune for a bear oh, of this yeah. nature. So look at what you're getting here, something that is truly original. Uh, you're getting your stuffing in the mix, your stuffing will arrive, you've got your stuffing, everything you need to make George the Bear, barring the knitting needles, so just uh, make sure you use the right knitting needles for the job. Yes. Also, I'll just mention that some of these textured yarns are really hard to work with. Yeah. We make sure that when we're looking for different yarns for new mm -hmm. items, that they are nice to use. Yeah. It's got a lovely thread. So yes, well, really nice. You, I, I know in speaking to you, and uh, I know both yourself and your mum place so much emphasis on not only the quality, but making the kits. This yeah. isn't something that is just mass produced, you just knock out each one of these are uh, so personal to you, yes. and it will come across, and that's what I want to invest in as well. 20%, are we approaching 20% of the stock here for our George the Bear? We love George. We also love, this is where, I'll but say about know. Kim. So uh, my producer Kim, now she started seeing Look. <laughs> now come on. <laughs> so we've got, if I just, look, you've got the little booties. Thank you, Ben. 
There you go, little blue cheese. There's the bag that's going to arrive. It's the same thing. I'll hand that back, Ben. Thank you. And then we've got... Well, who's this? Oh, that's baby bear. You've got a little baby mm -hmm. bear. Hot water bottle. You've got a hot water bottle and there too. Now, are these options? So you go for either pink or blue. And I'll just show yep. you here. Oh, this is very sweet. Actually, I'll... No, I don't know. Okay. Look. Oh, come on. For 11... <laughs> so, 11.49, we're able to make the... Are they slippers? Yes. Slippers, hot water bottle, and your baby bear. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Done. <laughs> the whole team, if you could just hear in my ear, Aww. everyone's just saying, that's it, cute, we want it. So these uh, are the ones that we're going to be building, uh, uh -huh. so it's, we've called it a little paws collection, yeah. and so we're going to be doing different animals, and they will all be able to wear the same clothes. Look at this. So in the future, and every time, so I know this is only Claire's uh, third show here at Hochanda, but two previous occasions, been incredibly busy and in the future Claire and Sue uh, you plan on such your mum as well yeah. uh, your business together yes. that you plan on bringing us more characters who the clothes will fit yes so I love it it's gonna grow the world's gonna grow yes it is uh, I assume your mum's watching oh, I hope yeah, so it'd be so. nice for us to be spotted well, like that there we go. <laughs> she's like well, you're on TV <laughs> hello Sue by the way you're both very talented uh, it's nice to work with your mum too yeah, yeah it is yeah so. okay who's this so this is Gracie Bear so it's exactly the same pattern as George uh -huh. the bear yeah but she just got different clothes oh we like Gracie hello Gracie should we give everyone away there you go oh Gracie is lovely she feels so soft we like Gracie 2295 your price there 633 728 your item number saving three pounds now there has been cutie warnings throughout I haven't delivered the cutie warning but officially there is a there should be a clax like rrr, rrr, cutie warning <laughs> look who is this so this is Harry. He's one of our best sellers. Oh, Harry. And he's probably our easiest item to knit. Oh, oh and, we like and Harry. And quickest. What's, oh, okay, a little belly rub. There you go. There you go. Good boy. So it feels so incredibly plush and softer. Yeah. You're getting everything you need to make Harry, but not just Harry, because this is going to be a game changer. You get to knit Harry some clothing, so he gets a little scarf. He gets it's a coat, little coat yeah. in there as well. Uh, there's another little scarf you can make him. You've also got a lead, but wait for this. This is the true game changer. If I pop this down, you even knit him his bath. Let's stick him in his basket. He's got his little dog bed. I say basket. His little dog bed. He loves it. Oh come on! I'm gonna. There we go. We'll stick you in there. So you're getting all the yarn to make all of that. So your dog basket or dog bed uh, and Harry and all the clothes. And look at all of this. 10% uh, of the stock's already gone. Sorry, stretch that. 20% of the stock has gone there. Uh, we love our Harry. 138971, your item number. And it's Crufts ready. Hey. It's Crufts ready. He is Crufts ready. Uh, well, he, I mean, look. Best in breed. <laughs> Happy dog. That's what we like. Uh, who's this? This is Josie Mouse. Josie Mouse. So again, an Aaron. Yeah, and that was used for her. Yeah. I said, because dogs, when their tail's up, they're happy. Yes. Because the team thought, I said, look, that's a sign. If the dog's tail was between his legs, it'd be scared. Hmm. Uh, now, this is a character. We love her. So this is our Josie Mouse. Beautiful knit. Hmm. Claire, we love Josie. All the characters you're going to fall in love with. Uh, so Josie, you're getting everything you need to make Josie. I'm only speeding up because I know we've got to get to demonstration. 19.95 your price there. 075-804 your item number. And finally, we have the main man. This is Stan. Stan. It is. Got to point out with Stan, you get everything you need to make one Stan. So one Stan doll. <coughs> But you also get all uh, the components to make the clothing. So you can see here, Stan in both his different clothing. So you're making one doll, but you can make the... I love that. Look, the backpack. Come on. <laughs> Look at that. So Stan with his clothing. He's got his jumper. You get uh, the doggy in the mix as well. So his best friend. Does doggy have a name? Scruff. That's Scruff. <laughs> You've created a whole world. So I just really want to be clear on this. You're not getting two dolls. So we've just shown Stan in his two different outfits. So you get enough uh, of the yarn to make the two outfits, and then you're getting enough to make your doll and the dog. That's right. Yes. For 22.45, utter bargain. 
Seriously, <laughs> utter bargain. Uh, uh, 098578, your item number. We have got queues on our phone lines, and we've had steady queues throughout the most of this hour so far. We are 15 minutes into the hour. We're going to get to demonstration. Let me show you the patterns as well. So do have a little look. We have got patterns on the show. If you do want to add these to Now, these are nice. We've got our Tom Bear, you've got your Marion Ann Sardine, you've also got Mabel the Sheep Knitting Pack. $9.99 your price, so uh, three individual characters, 713-837, your item number there. Okay, what are we going to do? We're going to do Harry. So okay. like I said, this is one of our easiest designs so yeah. far. So I wanted to show you that more or less, this is knitted in one piece, so this is the front of nice. Harry, and okay. a, apart from his nose, he's mm -hmm. knitted in almost a single piece. Brilliant. So super easy. Yeah. He's knitted in all garter stitch, mm -hmm. so every row is knit, so it, it does make up really fast. Nice. And so to make him stand up, all we've done is knitted him a pair of back legs yeah. and attached them to the body. Uh, okay. So instead so he's of making a, in that a centre position. Yeah. So instead of making a sort of centre body section, yeah. his legs just sit neatly at the back like that and it stands up really nicely. Nice. So I just wanted to show you how that okay. went together. Just to let you know we are approaching half the stop for Harry, so uh, just a busy show. Wow, right. Nice. And you were saying like with all the, you're really conscious of the fact of finding, because this is more like a speciality type yarn, but uh, yeah. would you class it as a yarn? Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's um, it's like a fur, right. a, a fur yarn. But yeah. you, can still, you can still knit with it and that's important. Oh yes, yeah. and it's really easy to knit and, and really it grows so fast, right. yeah. My sister-in-law has just started knitting after I did the last whole chanda, yeah. she started knitting um, and after always saying she could never do it and she, and she knitted this in one evening. Well, there you go. Yeah. So I'm just right. going to so, so the back section yeah. to the front section. Okay. And you obviously you get full instructions uh, when uh, you go for any of the kids. And this yarn is also really good if you're not very good at sewing up because mm. it hides it. Does doesn't it? Everything. Yeah, you can see that. Yeah. Well, you so see you're just going to go through nicely. So in through the leg, uh -huh. and then out through That's the body. So. Yeah. Lovely. And you say you use, uh, what stitch are we using? It's just a round and round stitch. Okay, round I mean, we generally say use mattress stitch and there's lots and lots of different tutorials mm -hmm. on YouTube to do mattress stitch. Yeah. And that would be particularly important with the clothes and things like that. Mm -hmm. But if you've never knitted before and you're yeah. just not sure of whether yeah. you're going to be able to make it up or you're worried about whether your stitching is going to be neat enough, yeah. something like this, nobody can see what yeah. you're doing. I've got to tell you, Harry, and I have got a completed Harry. Now, you're not just getting Harry, because Harry's got his own little dog basket, which he's very proud of. So, look, you could imagine Harry in your room. So you get the little dog bed, but also uh, you've got his collar and some clothing uh, in the mix as well. So thank you, Ben. So you've got all of these elements that you're going to... Now, once Harry is gone, he is gone, we know that we're not able to add any more stock, and we are uh, half the stock. Actually, no, scratch that. We now moved to jump to 60%. Oh, All right, okay. Busy. It's okay, no worries. Right, so his legs are on. So I'm just going to take that mm -hmm. out through his leg. And we'll cut that off. Now, there is one major plus to getting Harry, because if you've ever had a puppy, a lot of training, Harry is, he comes, he arrives fully trained. He does, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, house trained a lot. House trained. Doesn't pull on the lead. Doesn't, he doesn't, uh, Chew up on the carpet no, or the woodwork. No, it doesn't mind when you're eating your dinner. Nice. No. Yeah. Good lap dog. <laughs> <laughs> but they, look, joking aside, he's very, he is very cuddly. Yes. Yes. So it's a really, really tactile yarn. Yeah. Yeah. Now, do we need to be careful? I was just feeling the eyes. Do we need to be? Oh, is that sewn in? So yeah. that's good. So you yeah. don't have to worry with kids because I know eyes something of toy safe eyes. So would this be safe to give to little ones? Yeah, I would. I would say on the. Um, we call it his necktie. Yep. So in the kit, there's this wooden bone. Just leave yep. that out. If yep. it's for a, a okay. younger child, just leave it out. Oh, I like that. There we go. Okay. So now just pop in the tail on. Nice. So in through the body. And do you have any pets? Do you have a dog? We've got a dog, yeah. Um, Is Harry modelled on your pooch? Absolutely not. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what dog do you have? So we've got a, a Border Terrier. Yeah. Oh, cute. And I think this is more uh, spaniel. Spaniel. It could be a puppy, sort of Labrador, golden, golden retrieval. Yeah, yeah uh, perhaps. Retriever. Uh, a cockadoodle. No, what was it? Cockapoo. Cockapoo. Yeah, do you think? 
Cockadoodle. Cockapoo, there are so many different That's variations. That's isn't it? Which one? Cockadoodle, is it a hen? Yeah, that is a, that is a, I just yeah. think that's a hen. I don't think that's a <laughs> Yeah. It's a, it's a, yeah. We've not knitted before. It's a labradoodle. Is it a labradoodle? Or yeah, cockapoo? or cockapoo. cockapoo. Yeah, all yeah. those things, yeah. So his tail's on. Yeah. It's nice. Just snip that off. Uh -huh. And then we'll pop his ears on. Nice. So his ears, you go from the cast off edge. Okay. The top. We're up 70% with Harry, and the only reason I'm giving those details is we know categorically once he's gone, he's gone. On some of the other kits, we might be, be able to add li a little bit of stock, but emphasis on a little bit of stock. Uh, Harry's been very popular. We've also got five minute queues on our phone line, so I am so sorry if you're currently stuck in a queue because it's one of my bugbears. I hate being stuck oh, in a queue. Yeah, so, so uh, if you do want to avoid the queues or jump the lines, you can always uh, place an order on our website, hochanda.com, or I've started to use the Hochanda app. Claire, have you got the Hochanda app? No. You've got to do, have you got a smartphone? Yes. When you've got a free moment, go into, uh, so have you got, is it Android or Apple? Yes. Okay, Android. Go into your Play Store, just type in Hochanda, we've got our own app, and I use it all the time now, just to watch. So it's great. You, when you open it up, you can watch live, and you can also shop through the app too. And what's oh. even better is you can revisit, so if you type in date, this hour, you can watch yourself back, if you wanted to. <laughs> or tell your friends, if any of your friends missed you. Yeah, okay, so show what, it over the ears. Yeah, yeah let's do that. So the ears, I would, I would ask you or mm -hmm. uh, advise you to take your time with the face. Yeah. It, it kind of gives it all its personality mm -hmm. or not. Did you, how did you build up the ear initially? So how did you create the actual ear? So it's just, again, it's just garter just stitch. Just garter stitch? Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. So if you like, you can pin them in position mm. and just... Can, can you see turn, that? Yeah, if I just turn him that way, there you can see the ears. He's starting to come to life. Yes. Beautiful. And do you know, Harry, depending on the collar, you can turn into a little girly dog as well. Yeah. You can be a girl dog, mm -hmm. so a pink collar. Yes, and if you've got any remnants of yarn at home, mm -hmm. the coach, you could do a number of different ones. Yeah. yeah. It's just yeah. A, a normal double knitting cotton. Yeah. So, sorry, Harry, we go in at the top of the ear, through his head. Mm -hmm. Okay. And out through his other ear. Nice, so securing it nicely. No, yep. no Harrys were hurt in the making of that. No, Harry. it doesn't mind. And then the same again. Okay. And through the second ear. First ear and through the second. Lovely. Okay. And that's it. And it's come together very nice. So that's actually nice and secure now. Yeah, I mean, you could go through, if you've got, I would probably go through again. Yeah, okay. But it does, it, it's easy to work with, which is important. Oh, yeah, it is. So no frustrations there. I and very forgiving, too. It is. I don't tend to cut the yarn off. Can, I don't know if you can see that. You I, just turn it to the camera three. That's okay. The camera. There we go. So instead of cutting the yarn off and leaving a sort of yeah. unneat uh, end on, I push it through his head mm -hmm. and pull it down. And it also helps to keep the ears in position right and I can cut it off at, at that point perfect yeah. Very nice. <laughs> lovely so I can take the pins out uh -huh. and there we have our Harry with his beautiful ears we do and I'd thread that through I'll just yeah. do the eyes okay. first before we move on to the eyes there's a little character that wants to say hello who is this George, proving very popular, approaching 60% of the stock, and he's looking very chuffed with his lovely jumper uh, and his scarf. So remember, in the kits, and look at his little trousers as well. He, so George looks like he's, he's uh, I know it's a little bit uh, tenuous because schools have closed, but he looks like he's off to school. There we go. Oh, I don't think so. There we go. He looks like an old school uniform. Very, very cute. So he's got his, I say trousers, he's got his little shorts. So he's yeah. got his, uh, it's like a school jumper going on there and then his scarf. We love George and you're liking George too. So uh, approaching 60% of the stock for George. George, so you want to sit on my, my knee? There you go. George has um, mm -hmm. mobile legs. Do you want to show everyone your legs? Okay, <laughs> all right. Do you want to show? So it makes him be able to sit down. His legs aren't in a fixed position, they're kind of jointed. And he, sit, he does sit he sits very lovely. nicely. There you go. We like our George. <laughs> He's a good boy. Shall we put some eyes on? Yeah, let's do let's it. Let's do some eyes. So in with a, a black mm -hmm. cotton. Again, that's in your kit. Okay. 
and put can, it right through the. Can just show that camera can you get, there? It's hard to do it backwards. Sorry, I know. Let's, I'm let's, sorry. Yeah, we're on. So in with your needle mm -hmm. through the back of the head. Yeah. I've got to tell you, we've just got a limited stock for Harry. Oh. There's he. It's okay. No rush. Okay. So. Mm -hmm. Nice. And so I'm, what I'm creating is a French knot. Yeah. Okay. Now we tend to do, at this point you wrap your yarn yeah, around. Yeah, that's right. That's how I typically associate yes. a French knot. Yeah. Uh, some people want to go around again if mm -hmm. you want the eyes to be a bit bigger, mm -hmm. but I prefer them Just once. It's nice because be it looks shaggy and his eyes are sort of hidden away a bit. Yeah, and the less, uh, they can look a bit staring. Yeah. That's nice. Okay. And, and when you do the add the, the eyes, the they the characters come to yes. life. Yes. But it's really worth taking your time. I think when yeah. when you've knitted it, it can be a bit of a rush to get it finished. Oh, that's but it's, it's no, worth taking your time journey. at the end. And this is look. This is why we love crafting. It shouldn't be a race. It's the journey and the enjoyment of doing it. That's right. Well, what's it like when you come up with a new idea for a new character? Um, Excellent sometimes, because yeah. so, sometimes they come together quite quickly, and other times it's like pulling teeth and, you know... It must be exciting once you have complete, don't you? You, you must uh, want yeah. to show everybody. Oh, uh, yeah. 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 Uh, and remember, we have got exclusives on the show today, world exclusives, so new kits that we, uh, that uh, Ho-Chan, that you can't find anywhere else, George, I should say, uh, is our world exclusive. Yes. So they only went live last night. Uh -huh. Nice. Okay, second eye. Lovely. And... This is what I love about working at Hochanda, is the fact that as a presenter we're able to introduce you to such fantastic brands, but businesses of all shapes and sizes, family-run businesses that bring you something. And I was saying to you before we went live, Claire, what I love about a family-run business is all you can see how much uh, effort and of yourselves you've put into all the kits. They're yeah. so personal to That's you. That's right, yeah. So we design them, we put the kits together. Mm. It's me that takes them to the post office. Oh. You know, we do every aspect of They're the business made with ourselves. Love. They are. Yeah. Brilliant. Okay. So Let I think anybody who might have or love, let's just say you uh, might have had a pet in the past or a dog uh, and now you can't, you might be living in a flat and you're not allowed to have dogs. Uh, or you do have a fur baby in your life and you just want to add to the mix. This is Harry. Remember, Harry comes with his own little doggy basket. There's his doggy basket. He's a good boy. And we've even got clothes for Harry as well. So uh, you can knit his lead. We've got his little coat in there as well, so you'll be able to do that. I've uh, got buttons too, and also his little scarf so you can add on him. Okay. Harry is about to go though. He is limited stock, uh, but we're into single figures, so he is about to go. Oh. And that's saying something, considering you really did add a lot of stuff. Yes, stock I this did, time. yeah. Good. Okay. So I have just the nose to do in a second. Nice. Yeah. So the nose is. A knitted nose, uh -huh. so it's um, just a couple of rows of uh, garter yeah. stitch again. Right. So when you cut your yarn off, yeah. can you see that black dot at the back? Yeah. If you just get a needle and pull, and that will um. disappear into the back. I left that a bit long actually. Uh -huh. like oh, there we go. Oh, disappears. Yep. And the nose. Okay. So how do we build up the nose? So again, I would have a look. So if you pinned it. Mm -hmm. I've got to tell you that Harry, I'm afraid, has technically sold out. Sorry. Uh, but there we go. Look, you've got full instructions when uh, Harry arrives. Uh, so i just got to tell you, with the technical sellout, what that means is all our stock is either sold or uh, sitting in baskets. So if you have got Harry currently sitting in your basket and you really want him, because we can't add any more stock, this is it, what we have, what we have, uh, my advice is do make sure to check out so you do not miss out. We're going to have a quick recap because we are halfway through the show. Is that okay? That's fine, yeah. Uh, once we do, I'll tell you, if you maybe put on the nose while I'm doing recap, Fab. we can show that. Yeah, that let's work? do that. I'll show that. Uh, so same technique, by the way, just in case anyone's worried. Uh, how we applied the eyes, same thing to the nose, you're just tacking the nose on. Yes. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's jump onto the website and have a little look. So uh, all the kits, and I've got to tell you with the kits, they are full kits. You're getting absolutely everything you need in the kit. So you've got your stuffing, you've got yarn, really good quality uh, yarn in there as well. So, uh, and it allows you to, I mean, with the kits, there's so much more than just the characters. And that's what I think makes sardines 
for Tea, such a special company. So I hope you're enjoying the show. If you do have any questions for Claire, we would love to hear from you, studio at hochanda.com. Uh, what kits are you going to be popping into your basket? I tell you what, Claire, I'm going to... Kim, what would you like? Kim, our producer. Holly, I'll, I'll get you one as well, our director. And we've got to get Ben, our floor manager, one as well. So uh, add whatever you like into basket on me. But you've got to tell me what you want. Okay, so Kim's gone straight for the bedtime set. Uh, and uh, Holly wants a big fox. Ben, what can I get you? He's looking. It's only... You want the rabbit? All right, we'll sort that out. Uh, let's start here. So we've got this fantastic little character. This is Archie. Need a half the stock for Archie. Oh, he's, he's happy with that. So there's Archie. I love, look at that, his little neckerchief that he's wearing. He's very, very cute. Incredibly soft. He, like, he does like ear, ear scratches. There you go. Good boy. Uh, so there is our little Archie. 1995. your price. You can see you're getting everything you need. Uh, you've got your stuffing in there. You've got this beautiful... Uh, sort of fur yarn. It is a faux fur, uh, obviously. And then you've got your um, more yarn in there as well with uh, cotton content too. Right, so I say cotton content, 100% uh, cotton. So yarn like this will be 100% cotton. Uh, another yarn will have that, will blend. Uh, now we're going to move on to Margot the cat, who we love. So I've got to tell you, with Margot, you see this rather dashing uh, little jumper, or it could be a little cardigan that Margot's wearing. That's included in the kit. I love the bell. The addition of the bell as well. So that's that collar with the bell. So there's Margot, a real character. So this is a, a litmus test at the moment. What, with regard to Archie or Margot, who's on top? Is it the dog lovers or the cat lovers? Mm, we'll keep you in suspense. 19 at the moment. Ar Archie's more popular. Now wait, wait one second. Wait a second. I know how many cat lovers there are out there. We need to start representing. So if you are a cat lover, come on, for Margot, for all you cat lovers out there, uh, you've got to get yourself a little Margot. 19 95 is your price, 867-529, uh, your item number. Now we've got, well, we haven't even talked about the rabbit fans out there. If you have your own little house bunny, uh, maybe, uh, I'm not going to do that with all the characters, you know, the fox and the bear. Uh, look. I do like the fact that we've got little Arthur, uh, our bunny. So again, it's the clothing, it's the attention to detail uh, that you are getting here. So I love, I love the yarn that's been used in there. There's Arthur, uh, 1995 your price for your very own. Look at the ears. Can I just ped? Look at those ears, they're very cute. 733-769, uh, three, three, your item number. You're getting everything you need in the kits. The only thing, and that applies to all the kits on the show, the only thing you will need to use, uh, or add, I should say, is just have your own knitting needles. That is it. Size of knitting needles uh, will be reflected in the instructions because they do vary, but you will be uh, in the instructions. It will tell you what size knitting needles. Now, here's our fox. This is Reggie. We have uh, brought a Reggie in the past, but this is the big Reggie. Uh, he dwarfs our little Reggie. Actually, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna get little Reggie and just show you a little comparison. This is like Reggie Jr. If I just pick Reggie up, you get to see the difference. So there's little, uh, it does look like father and son. Look at them. There you go. It's very similar, I have to say. Uh, I've been out, walked to the shops with Ben, our floor manager. We look, it's, it's kind of the same comparison. There we go. This is Ben. He's very, very tall. So I'm going to pop that there. And that's our big Reggie. Now, with Reggie, you're getting everything you need. Uh, can, oh, I've got to show you something with Reggie. Look, oh, let me just turn that around. Look at the tail in there as well. So he's got, he's got a fine tail. He's a happy fox. There we go. Let me turn you around. Good boy. There you go, Reggie. And... I will just do that. Okay, so there's Reggie, 22, uh, 22 95 your price if you want to get your very own Reggie. Stuffing included, obviously all the yarn, the pattern, everything that you need. But here's the thing, you've got Reggie and he's a very fashionable fox, so sometimes he'll just want to rock a different look. We got you covered with a brand new bundle. You've not seen this before. We've not offered it to you before. So this is the Fox Jumper and Waistcoat Kit. And look at that price for $10.34. You're getting your instructions. That is super cute. To make your own clothing, I think that is absolutely adorable. Uh, 750-911, your item number. And I know that Reggie would absolutely love to rock that waist jacket and jumper. Now we're going to go on to George 
Oh, George has been so popular. So George, three quarters of the stock has gone for George. Now we need to look at George because he is a very, very lovely bear. George, I love, look at these. He's got his own little shorts, his school shorts. Going. I remember the days wearing school shorts. And he's got the uh, little jumper and scarf in there. You can imagine him trotting off to school. There we go. Uh, very soft in there and very popular too. So. I've got to tell you, when George goes to bed, we have got, we have got some more for George as well. And you going to say, good boy. So there's George, uh, but have a look at this, because George could be rocking his own little dressing gown. We've got a dress, oh, come on. Dressing gown for George. So this is, uh, for this option, now you either go for pink or blue. Uh, half the stock's gone for, for blue. And we've also got our pink in the mix as well. Now, let me just show you what, what it'll make. So with the blue and pink, make slippers. So there's your pink option and there's your blue option. I'm sure my mum's got a pair of slippers like this. I love these. There we go. And then we've got our hot water bottle. I mean, how cute is that? And not only that, we're not stopping there. You get to make so either option. So pink or blue, you get to make your own baby teddy bear. We're not going to start. So you make look. Effectively, George has his own. Uh, he has his own bear. Because when he goes to school, it makes him feel better having his own bear. Love that. And the piece de resistance. Look at this. We've got our dressing gowns in there as well. That's lovely. Okay, eleven forty nine. Your price. Just going to shout across the studio to uh, Claire. Claire, with the hood, can we apply the hood to the blue, or that's just for the pink different option? Different pattern. A different pattern. Different okay. Pattern. So uh, if you're looking, the pink does come with the hood, and the blue doesn't. So different patterns. Just letting you know. Very nice. Okay. <laughs> that's awesome. Uh, then, oh, I've got to tell you, with what you're seeing here, so all the clothing, in the future, I know in the pipeline, that Sue and Claire are developing more characters who will fit the clothing. So if you want to start building up your family, that's to come in the future. Uh, we've got another exclusive, World Hochandra exclusive. This is Gracie. Now, Gracie is a lovely bear. Hello, Gracie. Do you want to give her a... She's... Oh, Gracie. What's the matter? She's a, she's a little bit shy. Gracie, everyone's very friendly out there. It's okay. Do you want to go? She, she warms up to you. Now, Gracie, should we tell them what you like doing? Okay. Gracie, she, she likes to sit while you do your crafting and also baking. You like, you like baking. She likes cups of tea. And Okay, Gracie, okay. And she, likes, she says, very important, if you do make her a cup of tea, she loves a chocolate biscuit with that as well. Three, three chocolate biscuits. Okay, Gracie. So there's Gracie. Uh, everything you need for Gracie. She is adorable. Uh, Twenty-two ninety-five. Your price. Six three three seven two eight. Your item number. Now Josie the mouse. <laughs> oh, look at this. Uh, we love Josie our mouse. Beautiful knitted character. So if you really want to have some fun, and if you could imagine uh, Josie a mouse, it could be. Now Josie could keep be in a bedroom, guest bedroom there, maybe in your craft room. Uh, we love Josie. Uh, 19 95 is your price, the clothing. Uh, so there's Josie. What I'm about to show you now is, I think, incredible. And this really sums up uh, Sardines for Tea as a company. It's originality. It's the personal touch that you get with all the kits. So here, you are getting, if I just show you, this is Stan. Now, you're getting uh, enough of the yarn to make one Stan. And this is Stan rocking his trousers, his backpack his hoodie, so he, he's off on an adventure. He's on an episode of Hunted, so there we go. If anyone's ever watched that, it's just a show. Uh, so there, there's Stan, uh, but then we've got Stan in a different outfit. Now, you only get enough yarn to make one Stan doll, but you are able to make his trousers, his uh, bobble hat, so they're different clothing there for Stan. Uh, so you get two outfits for Stan, and not only that, Scruff, our dog, is in the mix too. So you will be able to make Scruff the dog, who is Stan's best friend. There's Scruff. Oh, come on. These are going to be talking points. There is no way, no how. If you've got Stan, oh, sorry guys, if you've got Stan in your home, he is going to be a talking point. Now, can you imagine Stan with whichever outfit? I mean, look at that. Isn't that amazing? Uh, 22.45, your price there, 098.578, your item number. Uh, that is your kit for Stan. Very, very popular. Now, we have got more for you. Take a look here. So, this is 
Now, apparently, is this Stan's wife? Marianne yeah, Sardine. Is that Stan's wife? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, we're going to have a look at the patterns when we get back. Uh, seeing them here, so we have got Tom the bear, we've got Marianne, uh, and we've also got Mabel the sheep in the mix as well, and Olivia, uh, who is our wonderful little ostrich. Ostrich? We didn't give her a name because some people think she looks like a flamingo. Or could be Other a flamingo. people, ostrich, so ostrich. she just got a name, Olivia, that's yeah. it. Well, all four patterns for nine ninety nine, and then you can dip into your stash. The world needs to know, Claire. Marianne, is Marianne, uh, is it Stan's wife? Are they brother and sister? Are, are, they, they, are they husband and wife? It's up to you. Okay. Make your own mind up. Just not both. <laughs> there we go. So, <laughs> I, th I, th I think wife. I think wife. Uh, now, how are we getting on? Did we finish the notes? We're finished. Yeah? Yeah, it's done. Okay. So we have oh, that's cute. Now, considering where we started, I think you've done a very good job there, Claire. Oh, thank you. Oh, he's just a lo he is lovely. Harry. Uh, have we still got Harry? Is he, is he, is he gone? We did, okay, now because I said technically sold out, uh, I think we did have a couple of bounce backs, but now he is uh, technically again sold out. So if he is in your basket, make sure to check out. What would you like to show us next? I'm going to show you a new technique that we've never used in our kits before. Okay. Um, we, we strive to make everything really, really easy yeah. to make. Um, but with this one, we thought we'd just introduce um, a fair isle technique, yep. uh, but in an easy way. Okay. And uh, this is something I know you were chatting to the team when we were getting ready. Uh, I'm just going to grab Harry because I'm going to keep him company here. Um, so you're saying that with your kits, you're really conscious of the fact, and over time, you want to introduce more techniques. Yes. But so introducing the techniques, but you still want to make sure or that they're accessible to everyone. Yeah. So, so it's still going to be so easy. It's, so it's a fair isle technique, and if you didn't want to do it, mm -hmm. then just carry on knitting the pattern without. Lovely. Doing the okay. fair so, so what kit are we going to be using? So this is for Reggie, the big fox, or the waistcoat. We love Reggie. One. There we go. So this is Reggie's waistcoat. Uh, this is our accessory. And I love being able to... This is where we really get to personalise. Yes. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Okay. So if you just wanted to do a couple of um, stripes <laughs> in there, yeah, instead of doing the... Show everyone. There you go. Square, that's fine. So this is what we're working on. Beautiful. There we go. Okay. So I've got, I've got my uh, Reggie, it's our large fox. Yeah. There he is. So when you're putting a different coloured yarn in, mm -hmm. this is what I do. Yeah. So go into your first stitch and then just lay the new colour over right. the top. Okay. And we're going to knit two in the teal colour. Yeah. Oops. Come on, fingers, do what I want you to do. Nice. And then knit one in the green. Okay. And then your teal yarn passes, oops, get the right one, just across. Don't mm -hmm. pull it tight, but just sort of guide it mm -hmm. across. And then another one. Yeah. In green. And you just repeat that mm -hmm. all the way. How, is Across. It, how important is it for both yourself and your mum Sue to, to source the right yarn for the kits? Yeah, that's it. So, sometimes um, we'll get a yarn and we'll have an instant idea mm. from that yarn. Because we work up with a lot of companies that we get to see the yarns before they're in the shops. Oh, nice. Yeah, um, nice. So sometimes the yarns come to us and we think, yeah, that's definitely a bear or, mm -hmm. you know, I can see a dog there or whatever. Uh, and then other times, um, my mum particularly is good at this, just sort to start something and say, oh, what do you, what do you think to this? Yeah. yeah. So sometimes you there's a inspired. lot. Yeah. yeah. So sometimes we do get a lot of inspira inspiration mm -hmm. from colour as well. Yeah. It seems you have had fun with colour too. Okay. So again, two teal. And if you can, I don't know if the camera can pick that up. Can you see how the yarn's just passing over the back? Yeah. Yeah. So. yeah. We got that. Yeah. So in this, essentially, what I'm doing is creating the mm. um, squares. Mm. Am I doing it too fast? Shall I slow down a bit? No, it's okay. It does come together very, very quickly. Yeah. And so we're not asking you to do anything different with regards to your um, stitching. Mm -hmm. It's just how to introduce another colour. Nice. Mm -hmm. 
Now, I'm conscious of the fact that time-wise, we've got about 10 minutes left, mm -hmm. and I know we do have a deconstruct of George over here. Will we have an opportunity to look at George? Because George has been very popular. Can we do that? Yeah, can, yeah. Only because um, I'm just, we want to try and get as many demos as we can. Yeah, let's Is that do okay? that, of course. Yeah? That's fine. Have a little look. So if I can, shall I pass George over you to can. you? So there's George. We've been working on. So talk us through where where are we at with George. So George has got his face on, ears, mm -hmm. and arm. Oh, look at the body. And a leg. Look at George. Okay. So when I said to you that his his leg is jointed, yeah. I'm going to show you how to do that. Okay. And I was just thought it would be um, worthwhile just to having a look at how we stuff because mm. people do worry more about putting them together once it's knitted rather yeah. than the knitting itself I think sometimes. And just point out we you do uh, add the stuffing to the kits as well yes. so you will get the stuffing in your kit so you get yeah. absolutely everything you need barring the knitting needles. Yes. Brilliant. Okay mm -hmm. so we say it's is best to understuff rather than overstuff. Okay. And you get a generous amount of stuffing, so I've just got, there's George's stuffing. Oh, right. I do love all your packaging. Uh, you, yeah. you see that you've tried to uh, really there's minimize no plastics, plastic. Yeah. yeah. It's nice. Okay. There, 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 there. So this is mattress stitch. Okay. So we're going in and out. Again, this yarn is excellent for uh, any beginners because it you can't see any mm -hmm. um, faults with the stitching. Yeah. Got to tell you, we are approaching limited stock for George. And once again, like Harry, uh, once George has gone, he's gone. Can I show you a completed George? So this is what we're working on. And he is so adorable. There's George. Uh, George, a world exclusive. So the first time uh, that Claire and Sue have brought us our lovely little George bear. Look at just the shorts. He's got his little schoolboy shorts on there as well. His scarf, his jumper. George is adorable. And the feel, that's one thing you won't be able to appreciate at home until you get the kits uh, once they arrive. Just how, how incredibly really, really cuddly soft, they are. Yeah. Yeah, you're very cute. There we go. I think uh, what we're trying to do is, is choose yarns that's... Um, lovely to work with hmm. and provide a good um, finished result yeah. and people enjoy either gifting or um, hmm. or having themselves it's yeah. just mm -hmm. and we have got as well George's bedtime kit um, along with his other half as well so we've got the two different yeah. options the pink or the blue uh, so there we go George Bear uh, knitting kit so there's your time for tea you've got the now come on look at that the waistcoat uh, waistcoat the um, you're getting the sort of robe in there. You've also got the slippers, the little baby, uh, the little baby bed, and the water bottle. So I'll just hold these two up. The dressing gowns are so cute. So different styles. That's a uh, Georgia style, the little boy style there, and then we've got the little girl style. Seventy percent of the stock's gone for the blue option. This wow. is something I think this that personal touch for maybe a new addition to the family, next yeah. level gift. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, George has gone limited as well, so we've got 10% of the stock left for George. So. Okay. Have you got, have you got another hour later on? Yes, what at 3 o'clock. What are you going to be doing at 3 o'clock? Yeah, I know. Oh, Claire. <laughs> Honestly, that's just what I'm thinking right now. <laughs> so it's been a really busy hour, so uh, yeah. Claire will be returning at 3 o'clock. We've got to discuss what we're going to be doing there. Yeah, we had. Okay. Emergency meeting after. Emergency meeting. So around about 2 centimetres down right. from his neck edge. We're just going to pop his arm in position. Okay. You're doing a good job because I know it's never easy. It's one thing to craft and knit, but doing it to cameras as well, favouring uh, to cameras yeah. is not easy. It's a no, challenging it's not. thing. No, you're doing a great job. And my fingers don't want to do what I'm asking them to do oh. either. Can that, how you third show, how has it felt? Are you still getting nervous? Yeah. Is that wrong? Uh, no, it's uh, not wrong. <laughs> it's not wrong at all. It's, I it's think I, if, if it was 33rd, I would still feel the you same. Find, you say that, there will be a time where suddenly you come in and it just feels... I mean, it's nothing wrong with nerves. It just shows that it's something I care. That you have. You care, yeah, yeah it do. really does. Yeah. So. But we're all friends here. We're all family. Have we, have we been taking good care oh, of you? Oh, you always take good care of good. me. Nice. Uh, I've got to tell you that George has technically sold out, so that's uh. a second sellout. Uh, George, we're not bringing back any more stock of George, so I'm afraid as it stands, George, if he is in your basket, you've got to go to go to 
Uncle Ben, floor manager Ben. That's Ben. There we go. He'll look after you. Uh, now, George is gone, but his other half is still in stock. Gracie, uh, we're just going to show you Gracie. And uh, see, I like Gracie. So she's made in exactly the same There's way. Oh, look. There's little Gracie. She's just coming in. And oh, oh no. Oh, there's, there's, there's a few tears going on because Gracie very upset that George has gone and she hasn't gone yet. Gracie, it's okay. You're still very popular. Yeah, 40% of the stock's gone there. Oh, no, she... Oh, there's, there's tears. There's <laughs> very so tears. Tears. There you go. She's got... No, actually, I love, the, I love the little dress for Gracie. Yeah. And she's got, obviously, her dressing gown. If you do get the accessory, that, oh, she likes that. There you go. Now, I think... Does Gracie come with a pink shawl, too? Yes. We'll try and show you uh, Gracie's pink shawl. Oh, now, that's very sweet. So there's... Look, there's a little pink shawl that you can add there as well. Lovely. Okay. So I'm, I'm showing mm -hmm. you how to pop the legs on. Yeah, brilliant. So yeah. to allow the legs to swing it's and the, same and thing the for bear Gracie to sit down, George. both yeah. of them, yeah. So put your legs in position mm -hmm. and your needle goes through the first leg, Yeah. through George's body, Okay. and then out through oh, yeah. the second. Okay. I like that. Can you see? Then they'll swing about. Yeah. Which means they can sit down nicely. Yeah. So again, yeah. in through the first and leg. Just saying now, so effectively, just imagine we were working with Gracie, and I was saying George, but exactly the same technique. Yes. The only difference between Gracie and George, uh, the uh, obviously the colour, yeah. uh, but also the clothing in yeah. there. So Gracie's just got a, a little bit of a lighter fur. Yes, so the pattern for the bear is exactly the same, mm -hmm. but the um, clothes that come with each mm -hmm. kit are different. Okay. Nice. Nice. There. And so his legs. Okay. There Are we on. go. And there's look. There's our little. Well, it could be Gracie. It could be George. And it just goes. You've done such a good job with the characters, oh, Claire. Oh. You really have. Oh, thank and it's you. A, where was the point when you're chatting to your mum, and you said? Let's create a company. Let, let's create sardines for tea. What happened? What was the, the background? My mum designed for a large knitting company. Okay. Before um, and when she retired, yeah. it was really. So she, I mean, she, she would have then had a huge amount of experience. So that's that's yeah. very nice. Having so that. she was being asked by the company yeah. to yeah. continue as a huh? freelancer yeah, yeah. designing, and okay. I thought there must be a reason yeah. why got to work they together. don't want her to leave. Yeah. 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 Oh, that's nice. And we've yeah. got a picture for you. Take a look at this. This is, oh, oh Miney the dog, oh. what you look at that. Uh, so there we go. Uh, there's uh, Miney the dog loving Hochanda. And she said, Miney loves, oh, she loves Hochanda. And Miney loves Archie as well. Miney, you're a very good girl. I think we need to give Miney a few treats. There we go. Uh, thank you so much for sending in the pictures. We always love it when you send in uh, video pictures. So <laughs> thank you so much. Okay, so uh, we're going to look at the characters. Now, speaking of which, Miney's uh, fave here. So we have got little Archie. Mm. So tell us about Archie. So a lovely, lovely knit for a baby. Yeah. Really lovely. Mm. The yarn is so soft yeah. and so lovely to work with. Yeah. Super easy to make. But character, but equally, and I totally agree with you. Great for baby, but I just think for anybody, if you just want a little character mm. in your room. I, I Now, looking at characters, and this is my first time working with you, I would say that I'd be seriously um, drawn to creating all the characters and putting them together. Because once you've done one, let's say Archie, then think, okay, uh, start adding maybe Arthur into the mix or your Reggie the Fox. Start yes. putting put them all together. Yeah. So one of the ladies that's uh, knitted our Arthur Rabbit yeah. said that she never loses her TV controls now because she always puts the TV controls across his legs. Genius. <laughs> Genius. Uh, there's Archie, 1995, your price if you would like to go for Archie, 703 472, item number. Uh, as we move on, we've got Margot. Half the stock of Margot has gone. Love Margot. You don't hear enough Margot don't anymore. Think so. Yeah. <laughs> Do you remember? Um, was it ever? No. It was, um, no. I know what you're thinking. The good life. Yes. The it good was, life yeah. of Margot. Yeah. Uh, so there we go. There's our Margot. Our little pussy cat. 19.95. Your price there. Everything you're seeing here, you're getting the kit to make your wonderful little Margot doll. Uh, seven. Oh, sorry. Eight six seven five two nine. Item number. Now Arthur. Good names. There's <laughs> Arthur Rabbit. So such a personality coming through. 
what really strikes me, and it, it, it's a compliment to both uh, Sue and yourself, your design aspects, the clothing is as beautiful as the actual characters. Yes, I agree. I, yeah. I kind of get that impression that the accessories are as important to you as the characters. Yes. Yeah, it definitely, because yeah. it, it sort of brings them to life, yeah. I think, yeah. yeah. 1995, your price, 733-769, your item number there, and uh, that's Arthur. So you are back at three. I am. What are you going to be doing? I know, I don't you're know. You're going to be joined by Derek, so you're going to have some fun uh, with Derek. Yes. We've had two sellouts already, so I do hope you can tune in. Look, you are going to have a great hour, and I know that Claire is so passionate about sharing tips and tricks, techniques. If you have any questions, so let's say you've been watching the show and there's something that you would like to see, why not email in studio at hochanda.com. We will always do our very best uh, to try and accommodate. If you'd like to revisit this hour as well, maybe if your mum did go out, uh, we can, it's, it's, you can catch up. <laughs> I'm sure she watched. I'm sure she was watching. Uh, but if you've just tuned in and you're like, no, I wanted to catch the, uh, the whole show, you can do that. Now, two ways. You can go onto our website, hochanda.com, go to Life Schedule, uh, just pick the date and the time. We've got a bank of 60 days. So the last 60 days are all stored on our website also stored on our app. Which, Claire, you've got to give a go. I will do. Okay, Hochanda yes. app. Next time we're together. That's what I'm doing in my break. Do. Yes. So simple. Uh, so if you do want to get the Hochanda app, uh, if you've got a smartphone or tablet, just go to wherever you get your apps from. So it works with Apple uh, or Android and download the Hochanda app. I use it all the time. And I'd love it. It's just such an easy way to literally just tap the app and suddenly you've got the live feed. So you're watching live and I shop on there as well. I, re I really do. I'm not yeah. just saying that. Thank you so much. First time no, working with you. I absolutely loved it. The characters Aww. are incredible. So thank did you, you enjoy it? I did. Good. Yes. You looking forward to 3 o'clock? Can't wait. Yeah, All right. that's <laughs> what we like to hear. Uh, I really hope you're enjoying your day here at Ho Chanda. I know there's a lot going on in the world, but hopefully this is a little bit of a respite uh, and we're going to add some fun. Speaking of which, just around the corner, we have our fantastic one day special. Emma and Paola raring to go and we have got some goodies on the show. So don't go anywhere. Plenty more coming up here at Ho Chanda. Finally, a big thank you to Claire, no, thank you, thank Claire. You. and also Sue at home, who hopefully is watching as well. Thank you for your company. So, Clever Prints, our fabulous one day special, and it's been so busy. Uh, so, do make sure to stick around, a lot going on. Then, we've got Pentel, another fabulous hour, uh, and after that, Claire will return knitting with sardines for tea. Hello everyone, I've got a minute or two to tell you why you should all be members of Hachanda Freedom. Did you know that with Hachanda Freedom you could be saving on your deliveries every month? For just a £6.97 monthly fee you will benefit from unlimited standard delivery which means the more you spend with us, the more you save. And you know the best bit, you can cancel any time. Becoming a member of Hachanda Freedom, you will also be able to take advantage of our exclusive Freedom member discounts where you can save anything up to 20% on an already fantastic Hachanda price. Freedom members will also receive our exclusive members badge and Freedom newsletter which will keep you updated with all the goings on behind the scenes. Just look at all these benefits for £6.97 per month. Over 10,000 of you are already members and we thank you so much for being a part of our family and sharing your crafting passion with us. In fact, I'm now going to hand over to you to tell everyone else about your experience with Hachanda Freedom. It's lovely because you have the special offers, don't you, that are, give you a nice discount, off, sometimes up to 20%. I don't have to worry about the postage. I, I can spend a fiver on something that I've seen as and when I've seen it, or I can spend 20 or 30 or 50 pounds, it doesn't matter. I get special offers, I get special discounts, they tell me when everything's happening, so if there's a special show I want to watch, then it's there. Yes, you do save. If you buy like I do, you save. <laughs> you see, you could be a member instantly for £6.97 per month with no ongoing monthly obligation. So when you want to cancel, you can. Just give us a call or go to our website quoting the item number 888888. So, don't forget, you get your unlimited standard delivery, exclusive freedom discounts, members badge and a members newsletter. What are you waiting for? Join Hachanda Freedom today and become a member of the growing Hachanda family. Hi, I'm Anna and I'm a founder of Craftbox UK. Craftbox is a box full of craft supplies that we send to our customers monthly.
all products are placed in a beautiful, sturdy box, which is ribbon tied. And we hope that by receiving this box, you will feel like it's Christmas every month. Make sure you don't miss the craft box shows on Hochanda. <laughs> we are kind of now we need to keep does this sense uh, of course oh, it is the one day special welcome if you are just joining us here at Hochana we're hoping to inspire you to craft and, and of course with the one day special which is a time limited offer that we launched last night at 6 p.m. and it was a runaway success it Emma is your own drawing yes all mine um, last night was amazing today mm. has been it's all amazing thank you so so much well I'm not, you know I was talking to Emma before because of course the one day special you have got four options and in each option you'll get two A6 stamps you can see them on the screen and plus an A5 now the is panning across all four options now of course if we are gonna go uh, individually about those options just very briefly so you know which one it is now the first option is the first which is you are stronger uh, because is for you are stronger than you know and there is a lot of different sayings in there um, you can see the packaging that is also colored so therefore you can see the they are real sizes as well I think they are yeah they I are so, so they, yeah, they are. are yeah so therefore you can see exactly what you're getting an inspiration on what how to color them right yeah all colored by me as well yeah and of course that features Mary the beautiful face Mary she actually is quite pretty as well she, the I long hair matches I my absolutely sister absolutely love her um, now Mary has gone individually so the only go way to get her is to go for the one day special option one or the complete collection which we will get to it in a second now that's all my one option number two we get Bethany in this one Bethany butterfly yeah, Bethany butterfly but this one is called the option number Number two or think big I like to think big and now of course life is your story as well it is life is your story it isn't, is, it? isn't it yeah it's quite mindful that's mindful. what I was yeah, going for with exactly some of them. and then I love that being a grown-up dot 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 no I so agree with that life is beautiful mm -hmm. well we hope that we can bring you some beauty in these days then we have got of course the option number three now every every eye every one day special the cost of this three stamp sets are 24 pounds and 97 pence making an individual the saving of 12 pounds that applies as well as this option here option number three love and be happy we need some of that. Life is like abstract art. It is, isn't it? Sometimes. It's and we get here the daisies. Yes, the daisies. It's a nice big flower. Um, if you cut it out a few times, then you can decoupage it up. Um, yeah. Even don't bother inking the tail and just have it the tail, yeah. the stem. <laughs> yeah. And just dot it about. I mean, it's look a at big that. Flower. I just love that. And of course, you have got that beautiful uh, very really different a uh, melting heart mm -hmm. I think it's just like you know, you kind of you know you make my well, heart yeah. melt something yeah, I was like gonna that. say my heart melts for you <laughs> that works yeah, that works that's, that's, yeah, that's insane it's ice cream uh, now that's option number three of course it's the um, lo love and be happy and finally we are trying and white blend in and I love that one because it incorporates Yolanda mm -hmm. yes Yolanda is after my mom oh she's got the same curly hair but really I thought it would torment her a little bit but it didn't work look so at that bright and happy and of course that yes. is the option number four or option uh, the other name the way of calling that that option is um, what is what's uh, that one would be uh, uh, why blending? Yeah, I said it. Sorry, it's my my memory. It's just kind of sorry. But however, remember every option you go for is twenty four pounds ninety seven pence and includes that twelve pound saving. However, if you wanted the whole collection, there we have it, all of them. And so it's sixty five individual stamps, the complete stamp collection. You have got all those twelve pound individual saving plus an additional saving of 13 pounds, which means that it's actually 61 pounds saving. However, if you're a Freedom member, you have a further saving. So it's an additional saving. So it's 69 pounds, 69 pence, I believe. It, uh, sorry, yet yeah, saving. So that means that if you are not a Freedom member, why not become a Freedom member? Because then you're gonna, a Freedom membership is at six pounds 97 and means that for the whole month, you will not 
not pay PMP to in any purchases that you make to Hachanda. So then it makes sense to go for it. Yeah, can I just show this yeah. sample? This sample here has got every stamp, every oh. paper and every die in the show. Oh. This is what one of the DT made. Love, love, it, love it's that. Amazing. And the front, she's had glossy accents, micro beads. It's yeah, just look at that. Yeah, okay, that that's amazing. And that is some journal, isn't it? And she's and still I, got the I other saw, side. I'm now, gonna keep of course, it and what you side. can do in here is <laughs> <laughs> then you can print it. Like, okay, so if we print it, for instance, if you have got the small amount of these, you can then oh, yeah. every day show in little elements in there. You can see there, and then another that's day. She, did. Like she that. just worked on her desk, yeah. and then when she sent it to me and yeah. I opened it, I was like, oh my gosh, and I got the crust of it. Yeah. It's fabulous. It's, it's fabulous. So it's fabulous because you, every day you can you know, look at and that. that book was just made with the flower power stand. And then you have got the tag as well and mixing and the up. Oh, look at that. I just love it. And every time that you look at one of these, la this is Bethany, right? Yeah. But then, of course, you kind of have uh, the element of, you know, uh, you can have a different expressions by the show this just morning. Change, yeah. Just change the mouth a little bit, add more eye makeup with your fine liners. Right. <laughs> just kind of, come on, we want to see that. <laughs> I have got a direction that's kind of in a playful <laughs> mood. mood. <laughs> mood. Uh, we are over three quarters of the complete collection already uh, sold out. 639-644 is the item number for the full collection. Remember, if you want it and you're not a freedom member, become one because you will save more money. Uh, of course, uh, uh, if you want one of payment, you have got that option. You have got also the option of Flexibuy. If you're a freedom member, you just kind of spread it. Three pay Payments of twenty six pounds and six pence, and of course you do not pay P and P. If you are not a freedom member, you can also spread it into three payments. Now, of course, we have got dies as well, haven't we? And of course, we have yes. got the uh, dies, which means now, did you draw them as well? I uh, drew these. Um, I got told you can have dies if you want. I went, oh, really? How do I do that? And she says, draw some, and I did. I love these eyes, not only because they are kind of that pink reddish, uh, pink mm -hmm. red uh, uh, color, but also because they are so cool and so useful. I mean, from this one, like the barbed wire sort of effect, it's just... This one's called Always Wanted because I've always wanted a good barbed wire dye. Yeah. Uh, I've asked people if they would make them yeah. and it, so I did it myself. And it's just, I love that kind of, it becomes mm. the negative from that. It becomes the moon and the stars mm. and, and, you know, it does. Smiley so faces, if you turn. Yeah. That way. That way. Yeah, wink yeah, eye. Does, yeah. A wink eye and a smile. Yeah, that is so <laughs> cute. And of course, you have got also this was I love the inis and outies from that. I love the scratches as well in there. They're kind of for flowers, stamps, but also like different lines. I think they are absolutely fabulous. They are a little bit different, a little bit, but it's still recognizable mm -hmm. flowers and splats and mm -hmm. so much more. Oh, look, I love that. I love that. We are over 70% of the dyes already gone. This is one of my favorite yeah. examples. You don't have to be bright and yeah. you can, can take grungy. I've got something similar to that. Yeah. To do in one of the shows. Oh, I hope it's this, so. this one because I, I can absolutely do that. Yeah, from the first no, we love that. And then look, me and ours. You should put a like, oh yeah. And you can, you know, if you wanted to put a little heart, the leftover from that, yeah. you could put mm -hmm. it. So that is absolutely, and then of course you can then make a collage. Now, if you want to go for the the, the dice, remember that we are very busy for them. Eight zero nine five four zero is your item number. Fifty nine pounds and ninety six pence is your price. Uh, of course, uh, making a saving of twenty pounds. If you have a flexi buy option, we do also have papers because, of course, if you want to stamp onto a pre-made collage or if you want to die cut, that is absolutely fabulous. We have got the option of the cool papers, which are Emma's own backgrounds that she has created herself, and then they have been in high resolution scan and then manufactured. So you can have some of Emma's work, and then you can pre-create. And I mean, ten pounds and ninety-nine pence for twenty-four sheets. 12 designs two of each and then what about if you want something more warm well we have got that option the vibrancy of the colors the 
yellows and the pinks shining through. I love the warm ones. Uh, again, A4 papers, uh, getting 24 sheet design, uh, sheets, 12 sh designs, two of each, £10.99. And your item number for the warm colors is 797-414. Right, so what Hi. are you going to show us? I'm, I'm going to show how I did the, there's a bag down there, I did a um, mm -hmm. transfer with it. Oh uh, yeah. And mm -hmm. all I did was, I got the fabric, pretend this is a bag, yep. I run out of them. Okay. And all I did was, I wasn't too precious because yep. I wanted a distressed so look. So that's the paper, isn't this it? This is the paper, this one. Yeah, and that's warm, isn't it? I'm not too uh, sure. Oh, that's cool. Cool. Has it cool. got the paper? Yeah. They uh, all matched together, you see, it was just because we had to give them names. Because I, I couldn't pick them, so... Uh, oh, well, I think it's the cool. So can we have the pool papers and we will show them here? Um, right. All I did, and then... Okay. So I added some to the bag as well. Or oh, linen fabric, as I am here. I won't do it all because I've got uh, them ready. Is that... And just a second, I'm going to double check uh, which ones they are, because that's what I'm... Here and then, yeah. Sorry about that. So I have got them all over here. It must be that one. Yeah, it it is the. It's got the purple and the green ones. Is the yes. cool? Yeah. Kind of there there. We are. So all I did was flatten it down with the cool yeah. cats tool. Nice yeah. and smooth. You what? Don't want to get any acrylic medium on the back. Okay. You can use any acrylic medium. I've done it with um, the stamps away okay, liquid yeah. one that. Mm -hmm. I've done it with Royal Talents yeah. and 13 Arts. Yeah. Some of them work different than others, some okay. of them are a little bit more distressed, so on and so forth. So that's all I did and put it off to yeah. dry. And then, this is the one, it's been like this for a couple of weeks now, okay. so I'm hoping it's not too stuck. <laughs> we'll see. So, did you let it dry completely? Let it dry overnight. This was being near a radiator as well, so it's really stuck. The papers will sort of peel a bit. But then you've got to put water, water on. I'll just do a little bit of it. I showed how to do the transfer on the wood last night. Oh. Yeah. And then. All right. And then. I thought I would do this before my fingers ended up too dirty. Oh. So, and then you just that. keep rubbing. This one and I've then they'll transfer the, the ink into the fabric. The ink stays, the paper comes off, and it just, it's quite soft when it's done. Okay. Um, it's not, I mean, if you used a fabric, acrylic, acrylic yeah. medium, it would be even softer again, I would oh, imagine. Yeah. Yeah. Don't quote us on that, but yeah, yeah. I would imagine that's, that's what it's made for, yeah. isn't it? Because which one was the one that you just used? The 13 mm, Arts. 13 Arts, yeah. Yeah, multi purpose. The medium, medium yeah. yeah. So. And I would guess one that is quite um, wet would be better. Wait, I've used it with liquid, I've used proper transfer, yeah. I've used it with um, matte, me matte medium. Yeah. As long as it's an acrylic medium, yeah. really, I would imagine. Obviously, the proper transfer yeah. ones. Well, you just show, do keep rubbing and that. Uh, of course, we are going to show you the different options that you have got. I have got the cool option here. So you have got here the cool. If I put them like this, can you see them? Yeah. Uh, look at that. I love, love this piece. Remember, you are getting uh, two sheets of each design, 12 designs, 24 sheets in total. They are A4. Look at that. Isn't that cool? I just love the crackle effect in there as well. Look at that. Keep going. And then we have got the crackle again, so you can see. And I look at that. There's beautiful words as well. I coordinate with the one that is special as well. Look at this. I love that. Now, two thirds of this option has gone already, so please do check out your baskets for the beautiful papers. And remember, you are getting 24 sheets of each, two designs of each. That was the cool option. Yeah, I'm not going to do this all okay. it takes a while, but that, this one I used a green one. Yeah. And that's how it comes through. It is a dry, so you may get a white, fill them again, then you just spray yeah. again and go back over. Okay. And then once you get it all off, that's what you get. Wow. It's quite distressed around the edges. But that's, that's cool. That's really and nice. So, so I thought we'll decorate that because it won't yeah. take long. I've already got some stamping coloured. I've even brought me iron. Oh, <laughs> so are you stamping on calico? Or? It's calico this year. Yeah. 
yeah. so look if you don't have any we have got at the mill shop online I know they do have got an option for calico I think it's the mill shop online okay. yeah oh, so are. if you look on the website hotchanda.com that will come up I'll store me acrylic blocks there I'm just going to plug that in so it okay. starts to warm up. So, of course, you are going to be using the stamps? Yes, use this the craft, yeah. obviously, so for fabric and things. Mm -hmm. So, the, why would you use Versa Craft for fabric? Because once you iron it, it's heat set ah. in. I just want to show how well it. Yeah. And that, of course, the circles is part of option two, right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Um, when you stamp not the fabric, though, leave the stamp on a little bit longer yeah. so it soaks in. Yeah. And then, there you go, perfect. Okay. Stamps yeah. absolutely perfect. And then you just go over with your iron to heat set it. So yeah. is everything in So there? that's it. So you don't put any, any paper on top or anything like I that? I would, if I was going to iron yeah. clothes oh, okay. with after. <laughs> but I'm not. So that's all I did. And then I will paint it a little bit just to show how easy yeah. it is. I, I want, I've got so many things I want to do, I don't want to... Yeah, the icing ins are on the show. You are getting 18 of these eco-friendly, 80% of the material inside is natural. And look at that beautiful. Uh, absolutely the, vibrant. You yeah. need a tiny, yeah. tiny amount. They're going to last a long time. And once they dry, the permanent... Yeah. Fabulous. All so they're water soluble when you apply them, but then yep. become permanent. So that's and fabulous. these ones here I've done, and I've coloured them in with um, fabric markers. Mm -hmm. um, the from here, the yeah. glittery ones. Oh uh, yeah, the craft yourself silly. Uh, yeah, the great little glittery yeah, ones. And I used acrylic paints for her, yeah. and just cut her out. I ironed the calico yeah. onto. Yeah. What's it called? Uh, uh, fusible what, what bundle web. There's something so like that. Fusible sticky. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And, and by the way, if you're thinking of fa a fa a pants for um, you know to m for fabric, after the show there is a pencil show the, with oh, uh, markers yes. that they will work on fabric. So if you want to see how it all works, you can see watch Leone and Rachel at two doing that after the show finishes. Yes, they'll work perfect. Actually, I bought Christopher that yeah. set last time it was on. He's been at school for. Yeah, and then your pill, different yeah. charity things. Yeah. The kids have to decorate their own T-shirts, so these yeah. would be ideal. Okay. And then, all right. I'm back in. I think I might need a bit of paper so it doesn't stick to the the acrylic medium okay. that I've got, but I'll find something. Okay. What do you need to do? Paper? Just a bit of. I'll just yeah. use one of. Of course. No, I use one of mine. I yeah. don't want to use the shoulders. Yeah. yeah. Okay. It won't matter because I'm going to do it on the other side. Okay, mm. all right. Oh, that's what you... Yeah, I just didn't want anything to stick yeah. to the acrylics I've used and the... Obviously, the pens don't stick. Oh. That was seen, but... The fusible... Mm -hmm. ...stuff. Yeah, <laughs> yeah fusible, yeah. You Actually, I'll tell you what else would work. The bone ash. The bone ash, the sprinkle stuff. Bone ash? Bone ash. Uh -huh. um, I've got some in the house. What's that? It's... Ah, it, uh, it's been on before. It's a... Like, a sprinkle of... Ah, it's a powder. Sugar, and then you just yeah. iron a over it. Powder, yeah. A bonding powder, that's bonding it. powder, yeah. I fixed Christopher's flowers with it and I ah. stuck all sorts of fabric with it. There we are. And take long and then... Yeah, yeah. But this little iron is fabulous. Yeah, uh, we, uh, yeah it's, 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 not, not, it's small, but she might be a little bit fierce but she's fierce check yes, for you that's the one just put this so i don't stick me arm on it yes. that home. so there we are and then i am just going i won't do it all I'll just do it up the side back in with this one obviously i've got a barbed wire stamp as well actually oh no oh, <laughs> no, <laughs> it's <laughs> oh. Chloe is on her way to. No, when I went into the meeting, I said, "Oh yeah, I'm all prepped. I changed yeah. my mind." <laughs> yeah. As soon as I come in here, I change my mind. So. They, thank you, Chloe. If you've got a stamping block, this might yeah. fit in there as well. If you're clever, yeah. like your fabrics and things. Yeah. And then so. you would use your Versa craft again. I've just picked Versa okay. fine up. So Versa. Look at that stamp though. Okay. The barbed wire stamp. So that's nice to knead in the edges mm. in there. Oh. 
Right, I need to tell you, of course, that the complete collection is um, quite busy. It's very busy. And, of course, we are, what is it, three quarters of the stock gone already? Over three quarters of the stock has oh already gone. God. So please do check out your baskets, otherwise you might miss out. It always happens. We get lost into Emma's demos uh, and we forget to check out those baskets. Remember that they auto-refresh every 10 minutes or so, so you might miss out. And to avoid that, just check out. Right, and then so you just plan. This is another one I've always wanted a good. I've seen it good. Yeah. It's good oh. for me. I know, I know. <laughs> yeah. But, and then if you don't want it to go so yeah. far, just go back in and rub it off the stamp. Yeah. I mean, you can do all your mask and tricks yeah. and yeah. just go back in with a permanent marker. Yeah. And there. And then uh, I love that you're safe of cleaning the sun. Yeah. I just clean the block because yeah. I make such a mess. Yeah. But, but it kind of frames it, it kind of brings that, mm. those lines in and there then and then kind of makes it really just yeah. go in. The yeah. fabric markers would be better for yeah. this, definitely. Okay. Go back in, add your detail, and then you need to go shopping yeah. to a craft shop. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, just well, oh, look like me because I, you know, I do have got quite a few, and I put my like fabric. So then I, I was going to say I like it better when the postman brings yeah, us exactly. them. Stay in my pajamas and then use it as storage. Yeah, absolutely. actually, the one I did in the first place has been hanging on the um, crafting slash dining room yeah. door with stuff in ready for the show. But yeah, look at that. And that is, I, I just mm. like really easy. Of course, it's featuring Mary, which is a part, of course, of the complete stand collection. Mm. It features the papers, which is a cool option as well. I think it's just, she's just beautiful. And those circles, I absolutely love that yeah. circle stamp. I mean, you can keep yeah. it whole or cut it down, have loads of little circle stamps. Yeah. It's up to you. All right, so that's really, really lovely. And if you want more inspiration, if you're thinking, what do you want? Well, here, there is more inspiration for you. Isn't it beautiful, the lampshade, with all the beautiful flowers and, of course, Yolanda being featured there. That is absolutely stunning. She's really cool, Yolanda. If you want to get her, there are different ways of getting her, but the best way, the best value is to go for the complete collection, the clever prints. Of course, the artwork by Emma Blake, and, of course, you are getting Yolanda. You are also getting Mary. You are getting the backgrounds. You are getting two hearts, beautiful big sizes, as well as those background rectangles and the squares. Look at what you can can do incorporating Mary that pensive image in there it has commanding commanding as well it might remind you of somebody you know somebody you have seen it has got very good highlights no she doesn't she she knows how to put your makeup if you if you use pastels or white marker pens you can achieve her and if you want to see how Emma colors her you can see at 9 a.m. of course catch up on rewind if you want to intensify the color of her skin you can do that if you want to incorporate of course different elements from the sets look at that that is of course be what the beautiful images proud of your one day special however this one is Bethany, and of course she is a little bit, it's a kind of 
you know, kind of has got that more say, kind of questioning look. So, or answer, listening look, and look at that. Isn't that just beautiful with the gorgeous colors? How you can transform and make it very vintage mixed media if you want it. Or bright and cheerful, and look at those beautiful flowers. They kind of, it's almost like hands, but almost it's like hands onto a heart, flowers into a heart. Arts kids keeps me sane. Color outside the lines. And then you kind of have here as well, of course, you have got Bethany in here with I use it with a overlay with those backgrounds and you can use them in different ways and those bursts of colors they kind of outlines color coming through and what about those circles that have got hidden words in there and then transforming them into flowers and you can use the stem in the border to transform it into a stem what about using Yolanda in here look at those beautiful daisies as well incorporating a stamps that you have got background stamps to create those layers of effects. A smaller projects maybe like this, maybe something that kind of has got all those different elements overlapping those stamps as well with some of the dice that we will see later. What about just kind of changing the colors a little bit surreal kind of colors, greens and yellows. What about creating a lollipop? with that melting heart. I love that idea. I love that chocolate ice cream melting down. I could do it with one now, but look at that oh, an ice cream, chocolate ice cream. Anyway, uh, let's move on from chocolate. And then of course we have got Yolanda and Mary with those beautiful daisies and hearts. And of course, look at the different details that you have got incorporated in the one day special. Of course, now please do check out your baskets. We are getting very, very busy for the one day special. And remember that if you were to buy them individually, the Sam's, the car, you know, you, if you go for the, you were saving, each option will save you t uh, 12 pounds. There's four options, so that's 48 pounds saving. Now, that has been carried forward, and if you go for the complete collection, and you have got another 13 pounds saving, making it 61 pounds saving. However, if you are a Freedom member, there is a further discount. So it means that you're, you're saving 69 pounds, 69 pence. And therefore, it's worth to become a Freedom member if you are not one yet, because you are not paying P and P. And of course, remember that you have got a flexible option. And whether you are a Freedom member or not, you can spread the cost in three, three, uh, three interest-free payments. Is that correct? Yes, I think it is. Now, that is a fabulous way to spread the cost and make sure that you get your bundle and deliver as soon as possible and play with it. Something that works really well with stamps, of course, is dies. Dies will die cut, and of course, using your standard die cutting machine, it will create those beautiful shapes in there. Now, that offers you another layer into your stamp and that your stamps do. I personally love to incorporate them into my backgrounds. I kind of create the focal points, create something like this, and then if you have gone for one of the one day specials or all of them, you can place them and there may be Mary or Yolanda on top of it. You can use them as a stencils, of course. You can layer them, die cut them several times and create that finition. And then paint them all into that teal and then use gilding waxes or something metallic to create that kind of metal effect. What things can you cut with them? Well, there's plenty of things like tin, drink can, string plastic, cotton, leather, uh, thin, thin leather, of course. Uh, bath towel as well, she's used burlap, uh, you know, kind of for you can say like acetate of course it depends will depends on what machine oh my hair is kind of stuck <laughs> into the, the tin can. You can, will be able to die cut it depending, of course, on your die cutting machine. All of the dies will fit through a standard uh, cutting machine, so an A6, uh, A5 so the sort of size, so the big shot, the cuttle bug, <laughs> and so on. Oh. I agree with that one. The spiral. Yeah, we're losing this one. <laughs> but this shows that you can use them in different ways, so the negative and the positive as much. Right, if you want yours, of course, your item number is 809540. Now, three quarters of the stock has gone. So please, you know, check out your baskets if you want it. You have got a 20 pound saving as well as the flexi buy option in which you can split, split the cost into interest free payments of 29 pounds and 98 pence. Now, of course, it, you can jump ahead to the website and there is different ways that you can order. Now, so for instance, some of the sounds may be available individually. However, the saving is, of course, in the complete collection. Remember that if you are a Freedom member, 
you have a 69 pounds and 69 pence uh, pay um, for, uh, saving in there. So it makes a lot of sense to uh, go for the become a freedom member if you are not one. And of course, you have got there the dice in there as well. So you can, you know, just add them and maybe flexify them and then sp in, in spread the cost. Now, of course, if you add anything into the cost of the if the complete bundle and you spread it into flexi basket, you can, anything that you added, well, you can spread the cost into those three interest-free payments. Right, so what are you going to show us? Then? I'm going to show the more grungy okay, metallic yeah. one. I've already used these and I've cut them out three or four times mm -hmm. each okay. and I'm also going to use the circle ones because I haven't used them yet Okay. on the shores. All and right. I, do, I love a good circle. Yeah, I, well that circles is something that is very um, I think universal. It's something mm -hmm. that is kind of very pleasing to the eye. It has got some round. Well, round oh, I hope they've seen yeah. one, but I forgot to take them down. Yeah. Oh, they have. Of course yeah. they have. I did it earlier and it shot up. Yeah. So you cut these ones three or four times as well. Yep. Yeah. And then your moons pop out. And then you've still got these. These could be screw heads and washers and things as well. So don't. Uh, yeah. I love the moon them. and the stars mm -hmm. that you get. Like, little so you just build it up. Obviously, you yeah. have grey board and things like that, don't you, to get the height. But for yeah. the sake of five minutes doing yeah. it, you can yeah. go through here. I did cut um, the hundred, uh, the 1,000 micro miller something uh, yeah, yeah. grey board with it. Ooh. And it did work. But the, hundred, yeah, the deal of the day, which is a polypropylene. And that's 2,000. Uh, no, it's 800, 800. I don't know micros. if it would cut that because of the den density. Oh, OK. The, the big dies would though. Oh, okay, like okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I thought so, that you were referring to that when you Yeah, no, it was a grey board. Ah, grey board. Yeah. Uh -huh. um, also as well, just try it. Yeah, just try it. Just try it, just, just go try. for it. I mean, so, of course, the thing is that they are paper and card dies. Mm -hmm. Then they're, you know that they cut uh, other materials that Emma has tried, but there is no nothing wrong with trying. No, nothing wrong with trying at all. Everything in my yeah. house has got a I mean, die shape. The worst you can get is, uh, you know, you know, you can just not cut. But yeah, I you know. did cut the towel on yeah. last night's shows. It might be this morning. Mm. I showed how I cut the bath towel. It was a posh towel. Oh, oh posh towel. Oh, oh, wait, it used to be a yeah. posh towel when it belonged to my grandma. Now it's yeah. not. Okay. So just line them up. Do, don't yeah. have to be perfect because yeah. it's going to be grungy. Yeah. So I've got all yeah. my circles and things. Yeah. And then the black tag. Just a black tag, black yeah. grey board. Yeah. And then we'll just glue them on. Yeah. And build yeah. it up. This one, I've built it up a few times. And then we are attaching that to the black tag. Yeah. Let's build them up. And then, yeah. All, then all those pieces done. are just so beautiful. So there's something really pleasing about them because there is something very organic. Um, mm. I've been, been, you had drawn them, then, yeah. didn't you? Uh -huh. I mean, the dice, if they'd been drawn yeah. how I hand drew them, yeah. I think the machine might have blew up. So they did <laughs> straighten the lines for us on that one. Mm. Right. See, this one, the craft. I love that. I love kisses. that. Kisses, kisses. Kisses, kisses. Yeah. I could just do a full card yeah. of kisses. I'll add about a thousand kisses on everything. Yeah. Okay. Unless they're for Grumpy, I don't add them on for him. Yeah. Grumpy's the boyfriend, in uh, case you. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> well, I don't have one, so. No. Yeah. He's all right, he's no bother. Oh. <laughs> okay. Uh. I hardly ever see him, because oh. I'm always crap. Oh. <laughs> You're going to have. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, and like it look like a yes. puzzle. Yeah, just build it up. There's yeah. no right, no wrong. And the, the the glue will dry clear, won't it? Yeah, well, you can always go over it with black gesso. Yeah. There's absolutely no right or wrong. Yeah. Okay. Move that over. I mean, when you're at home, you have more time. Yeah, of course. No, but I like I like that. It's building up that the elements. I the did. I did oh, a hard as well, I built it up. Doesn't matter, we'll just leave it like that because yeah. I'm just showing. Okay. So I wonder then you're gonna do then. Ah black. more black. More I black like just that. to hide it. More black, lots of black. More black. I mean I love it, I have black. Actually. Uh -huh. I, I yeah. this one. I did. 
I don't like to use all the brushes for black because yeah, it's a nice matte as well, the black gesso. Okay, yeah. Like matte black. Yeah, <laughs> like that, yeah. Oh. As you would have them straight. Take more time at home. You can well, put this on the boxes I think it and things. Great. I think um, a box would be cool decorated with this. Then you could put the barbed wire on along yeah. the front. Loads of different ways. Right, yeah. So that's it, Emma style for yeah. here for now. Okay. And I'll just give it a quick dry off, and I'll show how I got yeah. the yeah the. Um, so in the meantime, can I show the uh, the dies board? So basically, if you go for the bundle of the dies, you will have all these beautiful shapes. Remember that a die will create a positive and a negative, and you need a die cutting machine that is as long as it's six inches in width. Uh, it will take them. But look, you have got the positive, and uh, I just love that. This is kind of. I love the moons, and the and thing is, the could give it quite sixties vibe as well. Them yeah. ones. Yeah, I love that. Yeah, and also it could be you could put crystals in here, maybe or something like that. Anything so kind at all of, you want. Kind of the centers of Actually, big flowers. Actually, that one there, I've just had it. If you cut the middle out, it looks like a cog, and I've literally just had it in my oh. hand. Yeah. Oh, it could be also you know. I'll find oh, it in a second. It could be in also oh, all the different places you have been on a map, so you can trim those ones. That's yes. Emily's idea. So you can take like pinpoints in there, and then you have got here the beautiful daisy with those flowers there, with the little hearts and the bubbles in there. Uh, a snowflake, so you could be in a snowflake as well. And then look at those ones. I'm going to put in well. Either way works, Either. but that's the bunch of flowers you could do. Then those the squares. I love these ones. I have to say, I love. Lo oh, there's your cog. Oh yeah, doesn't it? Yeah, that. Let's show you what it is. Look, can you see what it works? It's just out the middle. I mean, cut the whole middle out and fill the middle with resin or glossy accents. Yeah, anything at all. There it is. Look at that. That, that. So the details for the, of course, the dies are on the screen. You are getting 26 dies in total, and of course, uh, you have got a flexi buy option. I'm going to take a teal paint, like mm. um, patina. Oh, patina. patina, 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 teal. Yeah. Uh, All the paints have now gone, so I need oh, just need to uh, use so acrylic. But you can still use them. Or use antique. Oh yeah. And then. That's what I did use originally on tape and stuff, but I know. And there you let it. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna wipe it off yeah. fast. <laughs> so I added water because so these paints dry yeah. really quick. That is fabulous. I mm. see. I love when you start putting putting the patina on and then mm. <laughs> yeah because it's the same word in Spanish yeah so basically what happens is I there are so many words that are spelled the same so of course my brain switches to Spanish yeah. pronunciation patina I think Spanish is brilliant either fit I'm honestly so ridiculously dopey Ooh. and the first time I went to Spanish you would think um, I've gone to a different planet. I just didn't you know, when you feel lost. It was funny. I was yeah. looked lost as well. Yeah, yesterday we were uh, driving with Leone and my mom called. So we were. I was talking to my mom in Spanish, uh -huh. and then she's like, "It's really, really weird to hear you speak Spanish." I never quite realized that you actually kind of speak Spanish. <laughs> no, like, <"Duh."> oh, <laughs> in Spanish. Wait, yeah. I just dry brush it yeah. over to give that metal. You can use acrylic paints. Yeah. Um, Gildan wax. Yeah. Whatever you've got. I love that. I'm sure of the paints, but these paints will come back though, eventually. And they ah, and see it's coming to life, isn't it? And the silver. And then I'm gonna put I've got the my happy places a day. Yeah, and then, okay, mm. and then just put it there. Let's go over. Obviously, at home, add more, yep. do more, take more time. Of course, but cave. that is amazing. It just looks, if you, you know, it looks really cool. So I've scribbled some, some of the patina coloured paint yeah. on, and I've got the My Happy Place. Oh, yeah. It's, I think, quite 
be Facebook groups called yeah, Emma's Happy Place. Yeah, that's what I was going to mention. You're, you're, of course, if you want to see more inspiration as well online, there is uh, Emma has got this group on Facebook called Emma Blake's Happy Place. No, it's oh. Emma's Happy Place Arts and Crafts. It's okay. the arts and crafts on the uh, end. That, gosh, look at me. Yeah, Emma's Happy so Place So if you look for that, there is a lot more inspiration. People like you that have got their, um, you know, different bundles like this. Mm. This is uh, Emma's second or one day special here at Hotchanda. So all that inspiration will be there as yeah. well. And you can and participate. More. Yeah. And more. I want you can post anything in there that you yeah. like. Um, also, can I just say I don't think I've mentioned all my details as well. I've oh, got Denise, yeah. Denise, Tamara. Tamara. I've dropped that again. Oh, don't worry. I'll get in a minute. Yeah. Tamara, Jules, Linda, yeah. um, Charmaine's done some stuff for us. Tracy makes the books. Yep. But unfortunately, I, d I thought it was poor this time, so she didn't get yep. the post office. But that'll be shared on Facebook. Yep. I love you. Yeah. You just make me look brilliant. Oh. <laughs> So yeah. you go. and they're all tellers. So yeah, yeah of course the deal. This is a, a die is of course f part of the collection okay. that you have got the details on the screen. This is my handwriting as well. Not like wow, it. happy place. And it's happy place. So I've got. Black. I love I love those eyes. I have to say, like I, you know, when I design eyes, I do very, very um, geometric and very, um, you know, symmetrical things. But I love yours because they have got that beautiful flow, that beautiful. Um, and I also think when you want to experiment and grow into con in confidence Actually, with mixed media. I'll tell you what you could do. I've got this die as yeah, well. This guy. You could put some loops. Oh, that's the side. lovely. I'll just do that now because I haven't used it yet and I get to the end of a show and think, oh, I wish I did this, I wish I did yeah. this. Oh, well, so that, will all that. Always happen. that will always <laughs> Everything happen. Everything now in this hour. <laughs> yeah. So you are, you are cutting just the edges, though, aren't yeah, you? To create like a through. label of it? or Yeah, just the very edge at the side because yeah. I've already cut the other side down. But it's just to give you an idea, really. Yeah. Oh, no, it's covered off. It cuts. Hang on, though. That's what. Yeah. Um. Just cut. I didn't okay. think that one through, did I? But yeah, and then you can okay. add it as and then little oh, okay. flourishes. Ah, okay. I've got Perfect. more yeah. in there. I'll finish it off and show next hour. Okay. Oh. I know. Yeah. That um, was a bad example, wasn't it? No, it's just that sometimes, <laughs> sometimes, like, you know, these things, no, you I'm show how to. you can use it in a different way. There's a card up there. Oh, no, she hasn't watched us done. The DT, she's cut two strips out, put the paper uh, on, and then glued the paper. And aha, uh -huh, silly Anna. Yeah. So you mean that you have is mm, it, the DT off. has like cut it, then attach it a streamer down mm. to the tag, and then hand cut it over one edge. Yes. So that has created that edge with the the swirls. Yeah, in. I knew I should have thought that one out. Yeah. Probably. I asked her. That would yeah. help. So now to sa to save it, you are just uh, fussy cutting around yeah. it, leaving a, a leaving black, black edge, edge all around it. Which is a, I love when when that happens because you show how you can fix something that wasn't quite working for yeah. you. Uh, do you know what it is? If you look at everything I make, there's a lot of things saved. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's that's. Because you have an idea, yeah. okay. and then if I really didn't like it, I would just put it in the bin and yeah. did it again. Okay. Um, I'm not precious. Okay. I did uh, get my little boy a fancy paint set okay. for Christmas, and he's using mine. He doesn't want to open his, mm. okay. so he's used all my paints and things. And then I would have my happy place yep. added on, and I have this was left on the desk yesterday. Okay. I like adding fabrics and things behind yeah. what I do, so. Okay. And then just a little bit, just texture, isn't it? Yeah. It's funny because uh, I was saying to Leon the other day that I had a bunch of, of boxes from my old house and I got a lots, lots of texture paper and mm -hmm. things like that. And I was like, kind of, it's so nice to incorporate them now into, um, you know, into different ways that we use them now that when I bought them 10, yeah. 20, 15 years ago. Exactly. Actually, mm -hmm. speaking of 10, 15 years ago. Yeah. Do you know Pergamano? Yeah, yeah. No, currently, that's the ah. tube of 10 years ago. And still looking, it's yeah. still all right. Still in there. Right, yeah. There is so many still products. Right. That's Fabulous. the beauty of crafting. So it, it would have my happy place on as yeah. well. And there, there it but is. But I've dropped the my. Yeah, there it is. It still looks like one yeah. that way. That way. <laughs> that's so cute. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. Like there it is. And then what are you going to do? That's it? 
that's it for this one. Okay, yeah. perfect. Move on to something else. Now, of course, uh, while you reset about yeah. uh, you know your next demo, we are going to give you a need to remind you of the dies. Of course, the dies you are getting four sets in total in this bundle. Eight zero nine five four zero is your item number. You are getting four die sets and twenty six dies in total. Fifty nine pounds and ninety six pence is your price, but you are basically getting one set for nothing because the saving is twenty pounds. Now. Of course, the, also the other thing I wanted to remind you is, of course, you have got that flexi buy option in there as well. Two payments of twenty nine pounds and ninety eight pence. Now, of course, now the one day special consists of different options. However, the biggest saving, or any in those individual options, you are getting twelve pounds saving. However, if you want to go for the full complete collection, Emma Blake's and by right, a clever prints one day special, the complete sun collection, sixty five individual stamps. You have got beautiful girls, you have got those backgrounds, you have got those hand-drawn circles with hidden words inside, this beautiful heart with flowers inside it, this, you know those inspirational, aspirational words, bright and happy, life is your story, a smile, life is like abstract art, chocolate, that's my word. Now it says it's all about, and then you can say art, color, and obviously chocolate, and hope. There's so many different elements, words, uh, beautiful flowers, circles, there is background scratches in there that you can build those scenes. Like this, you know, you can incorporate them into uh, the backgrounds in there, as well as the foreground. That's Yolanda, she's included in your a complete collection. Look at that. This is stamp here. Now, this is all the stamps that you think at the beginning, why I'm going to need them? Well, you need them to add that interest to the backgrounds. You need to kind of go it into the eyes to say, you know, yes, it is busy in the background, but the focal point stands proud in the center. Whether you are incorporating dyes and then under, under, underneath them, the stamps and then color singly. Now the pebble stamps are, it's just beautiful. Now to get them all, I need to tell you that 80% of the stock has already gone. So of course, do check out your baskets if you uh, are thinking about it, because to, we are uh, heading towards the end of the show and it always has a spike of people wanting to get the wrap there. 639644 is your item. Remember that you have got a freedom price, so you're saving actually 69 pounds and 69 pence, paying only 78 pounds and 19 pence, and not paying P and P. Now you can spread the cost as well. You have got the flexible, whether you are a freedom member or not, you can have it in three interest-free payments, which are not is you not usually is two payments. This time is three payments to help you out to spread the cost. Now we can find them on the website, of course. You can find the individuals uh, bundles as well as the individual stamps. Some of them may have sold out. I think Mary has sold out on their own, on her own. But, but let me there. Let, let. And your Yolanda has gone as well. Oh, Yolanda. But Bethany is still on her own. So if you want to, so and actually, I have to say that even on the full, you know, proud individual price, they are still very, very affordable stamp sets. But on top of that, if you go for the complete collection, remember you have a 69 pounds and 69 pence saving. And on top, if you're not a free, if you're a freedom member, you do not pay PMP. So that works out even better. Uh, right. I'm sure on what I meant before. I see. Yeah. Just so, because, well. So yeah, so I, she, uh, Emma has a st uh, die cut yeah. two of those streamer sort of. Um, yeah. uh, just do the yep. lines, you can use them as borders, yep. use them as... And then you can stamp. I've got such a mess going yep. on now. What's oh, this one? Just try, I know I've used that one a lot. Okay. Um, uh, what's this one say? Colour outside the lines. Oh, I like that that's one. Pretty that's pretty much my what colouring. I've been doing. That's, that's my colouring, always outside the lines. Just pretend you prepped. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, but also okay. when it's co it comes to makeup, <laughs> that's like that. Yeah. So just on to white card because the back actually yeah. it might show up in the back. I'll try it first. If not, we'll just cover it. Okay. 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 And then I think it's it. gonna work. And you're, yeah, it's this. 
Yeah, perfect. perfect. Then you can put embossing powder over yeah. and so on and so forth. And this can go on to what we started oh, earlier. Oh, yeah. If you want to see how Mary um, was done, uh, it was at, uh, of course, at 9 a.m. early today. Yeah. Mm. So this is, yeah. I start so many things yeah. and then I put them to one yeah. side. And then I go, ah, when I'm doing yeah. something else. And then I go back to it yeah. and... But that's what journals yeah. are for, in exactly. journals. Yeah. And then because she's yeah. moved, I'm going to add. Yeah, and look at that. And then back onto the black, and it just, it finishes her off a little bit, but wow. I would ink the edges and things. That's lovely. But it really bothered us earlier yeah. that she wasn't finished. That is just so oh. beautiful. And of course, I'm going to grab her and look at that. That's gorgeous. Now, do we, we have got about seven minutes, so... Oh, that's loads of time. I'm going to show on the bottom how I did this. I know that the inks and the paints have gone. Yeah. The ice and the paints have gone. Yeah. But I'll just, I'll just show fast in one corner yeah. and then I'll show how I did the... Yeah. All I did was that. Yeah. With oh, the okay. paints and... Yeah. And of course, you're using cool cat scraps, they're multi purpose te oh, teflon this too. too. It appeared on my desk last night, oh, I'm over the moon. That's so nice. But then um, Kay and Maggie was using yeah. the dyes this morning. Yes, yeah, yeah, it's just. They are lovely. I love well, they use whatever colours you want, that's yeah. all I did. And then I went in with embossing powder yeah. and just melted it on, and it gave us this effect. Oh, And it was see. obviously it's because it's been left with a palette oh, knife. Yeah. You've got the texture, and then I stamped with the yeah the thing, that, that the one. barbed wire stamp. Yep. And then I cut the squares out each one and built it up. But I have circles. Okay. And these ones are on the foam. And you have used them onto foam, black foam. On the black foam. Yeah. You had it on over Christmas. Yeah, I love, I love black fo uh, the black foam. Um, and it's the stamp uh, yes, uh, sheets. Yeah. And all I've done was put them out and then put glossy accents, gla yeah. glossy accents, yeah. slow down, over. Yeah. And, then and then just cut them out. It, and this, I think this is my favourite tub. Yeah. That's lovely. Tub, box. Yeah, tub, box, yeah. Tub, box, whatever you want to be. Yeah. And you just make your own stickers. And the 3D as well already. Yeah. Obviously I'm forgetting my own thing I preach, in ground the edges okay. so you can't see the weight of yeah. the card. Okay. And just get the glue off. Um, Add them on. Yeah. And these, this is exactly what you can do with them squares as well. And there's two squares, well, two different shapes, Sam. So you've yeah. got your squares and your rectangles, and you've got the bigger ones. Yeah. I'll use the bigger ones in the next hour. I come with your lander. And. Yeah. Um. Actually, I'll work in the art journal in the next hour, then I can go back and forth yeah. with the stamps. Okay. And just add them in, and then you can even this yep. die here, which mm -hmm. is this one. It okay. stays yep. together there. It makes a great journal clip. Ah, like I that. see. But yeah. I've just took that out. All right. And then locate the glue. You can use it okay. as a label. Yeah. Put it on. Okay. And then you touch it. And then you fussy cut it? Not really, just Okay. I think I take more care at home. Yeah. When I've got more than Could you if you do that, could you die cut it on oh, oh no because it's attached. But yes you could because it would just fit exactly behind with yeah. the weight. That's probably a better idea than what I'm doing. Probably. No, but it has got the inner one, doesn't it? Yeah, so but you can just chop it out. Yeah, you chop it out, mm -hmm. so yeah. Okay. Or even you could do it with them both. Yeah. Over the top. Oh, Diaper. Do it both over yeah. the top and just use the if inside you, as a label one. Yeah, so if you see it there, yeah. you can die cut it out of white. White, and then you could have yeah. it like that, like that, and then write Emma's or pens, and it just looks a bit more yeah. arty, doesn't it? Okay. And then I would pop it onto there, and I would write. Yeah. Um, yeah. Oh. 
And then you've been, oh, what's that you've been <laughs> in? A snack, oh, I like that, yeah. Uh, yeah. Go on then, you can write, you can label Some all your boxes and things. Mm -hmm. yeah. If you use the lighter papers as well, and did what you said, that yeah. would show up. Um, I'm trying to think of all the different things that was going through yeah. my mind. Just yeah. to it's, it's, it's great, isn't it, mm -hmm. when you kind of have all these things that you have the kind of design mm -hmm. and you can play it. Remember that, of course, the stamps uh, that are, Emma is cutting out uh, are part of the complete stamp set. 65 stamps in total. There you have them. There you can see all of them. Of course, with your land, and that's Mary. I love it. That's uh, Bethany. And then, of course, you have got the heart and the daisies as well as Yolanda. And, of course, you are getting all four sets. And, of course, you have got that flexi buy option of spreading the cost into three interest-free payments. If you want one of payment, 